Massicle is what it would be. Yeah, Massicle. <laughs> So anyway, um, we're still searching for the goods um, because obviously the flat earthers have friends and family that we want to be able to show to you know the nearest and dearest. Look, hey, it was a ball after all. Like you guys were right. Information we got from the relevant people were right, but we just don't have any proof. Hey. So, barely hear you. More. But the point is, is um, that we continue. It's like a quest for us. Like uh, we go on a mission, and we're just meeting different characters who claim that they have evidence of this globe. You know, so we eliminate a lot of the characters as we go through. I suppose there'll be a boss somewhere with all the knowledge. Super information we haven't met that person yet we're knocking down the ball earth is like flies like taking as se would describe it's like a candy from a baby like literally easy. like this is like <clears throat> one of the easiest endeavors we've had to uh, endure especially when it's been touted as you know one of the most intellectual scientific one of the most grandest things that we've ever supposed to have done but yet somehow a couple of flat earthers roll up and we're like, we point that out, that's not science. That's not science. No, that's pseudoscience. And oh so my goodness, uh, Kimo, you got beaten uh, by a broken English Japanese person before. Hi. Hi. What are you talking about? Like, what are you I trying to do to us right now? I gave him the black of the swan. the same shit for fucking how long? I mean, I joined this server like, what, five, six years ago or something? I don't know. Some crazy amount of years ago now. Listen to this Kimo... shit. And Kimo's got the same fucking script. He's... Yeah, I mean, look, as, as oh, I've Kimo, said before... Kimo's on point, though. Kimo is on point. Yeah, I mean, not the like definition of insanity, Kimo. Well, Kimo's I mean... always on point. It's very repetitive. No, Kimo has a problem, and we all know that. But if you don't look at yourself in the mirror and know that you also have a problem and me, <laughs> then you then you are very, you know, you are in trouble. Whoa, Jose, Kimo back has off a problem. Back we, off, all, back we all do. Why is everyone talking so close to the microphone? It's like really, really loud. Why? Goodness me, what is wrong with everyone? Kimo. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? That's what I'm saying. Jose is like Kimo talking really close. Kimo. That was Jose for starters. No, that was not me. I oh spoke my God, and Jose. then somebody spoke after me. No, no, no. You were you were the one speaking, but it wasn't it wasn't. And Jose, I agree, and I don't deny having a problem. I'm just wondering what mental mind fuck this is today. You know what I mean? This chemo rambling. I mean, does he think if we hear it long enough, we'll just agree to him? Like. Robotic, yeah, 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 or... like propaganda. He knows how the propaganda works. He thinks repetition is gonna persuade people some one way or another. No, I'm, actually, personally, I'm actually very welcome to chemo rambling because the whole night we've been hearing all the other mods rambling. Mm. Now, he was a mod, he should have his chance to ramble too. Exactly, you realize they're not actually. Kimo, have you realized they haven't actually answered anything you've asked? Question, they're just saying. Well, random. flat side, how about. Kimo has not, has not asked any question. Kimo is just waffling. Jose, waffling nonsense. Right, flat side. about science. Yeah, yeah, flat side, you asked them. Oh, no, he's not talking flat about flat science. Flat. Kimo, see, Kimo is spewing garbage out of his mouth. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yep. Oh, my but goodness. Stop messing around now. We need to get onto a serious discussion. Now, Flat Sword is here. Jerry right. is here. Lunar Eclipses. David Let's talk here. about them. We're all here, ready and able to. Let's talk to... about them. And Lunar Eclipses. Let's go. Who else is here? What about them? How do they happen? Let talk. Let, let Kimo us. talk. Kimo's I know how they work. Branch. How do they work on a flat earth? Right. Kimo's getting there, guys. Right, Branch, this is the last warning. Can you just let the people talk? I'm trying to help you talk, bro. It's not about me. Let the people know what I'm saying. Go ahead, okay, go first ahead. of all, mm -hmm. flat so do lunar eclipses happen at all? They do. Okay. And how do that how does that work on a flat earth? 
just like they work in reality. Okay, and how's that? How's how's that? The mechanism uh, yeah. is what he's yeah, asking the, for, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. I'm, not making, I'm not making claims. I'm not making claims about them. So okay, but you just made a positive claim that they exist. So now explain them. No, you asked to observe my city. So observe. Okay, so you observe them. So they're a real thing you observe. How does that observation take place on a flat earth? I don't know. You tell me. You're the one making the claims. I'm asking you. I don't know how it works. Uh, did I say I did? You said they exist, right? So therefore, by deduction of that claim, you have to produce a mechanism or a way or a method how it works. Now, if you're going to say it works the same way, well, that means that a spherical object passes in front of the sun's light and creates a spherical shadow on the moon. So now you're saying the Earth is spherical? That's why I ask how it works, because you say the Earth is not uh, spherical. I'm no, you're the one making the claim how it works, and we can debunk it just by selenium eclipse. So, so tell us how it works, mate. Just tell us how it works. Tell us how it works on flat Earth. Why? I'm not the one making a claim how it works. I'm just saying it's observed. It's you not. It's not a question of why. It's just a question of say. You guys are the ones. You guys are the ones making claim how it works. We're not claiming it works on a flat Earth. Same. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. We're not claiming it works. We're not claiming it works on a flat Earth. You just said it does. So ex please explain how. Did he go? Oh, he went. Hey, you're back. So you're the one claiming it works on a flat Earth. We're not claiming it works on a flat Earth. Please explain how. Of course it works on a flat Earth because we live on a flat Earth. Yes, so how? He's not going to answer. Yeah, he's never going to answer. I'm you can ask now. him. Look, you mate, can use just this say, exercise and ask him 20 questions. He will say, say the three same words. Thing. Just say three words, I don't three words. know. Say, I don't know. Yeah, say, yeah, I don't know. Just say those three words. Guys, he actually said that he doesn't know. He said it a few yes. times. You I said, said I do not know. What's your problem? You don't know how it works on a flat earth. That's okay. fair. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, that's fair. You know how it works on a flat earth. I do not make claims about it. So what else don't you know working on a flat earth? Was boom in their mic? Was uh, a model. The, the whole shape of the earth. <laughs> the whole layout of the continents. He doesn't know. Was. Do you know what else doesn't work, work on a flat earth? You what else doesn't work on a flat earth? Was. Do you know how it works on a flat earth? <laughs> no, no, nobody knows because it doesn't work. It's um, not flat. I'm yeah. Sorry. There I is no, there is no coherent flat explanation flat for it, anything to work on a flat Earth space. So, what yes. would you like me and Flatsoy to do? Like... Would you like me and Flatsoy to make up an answer? Yes, yes. please do. <laughs> yes, do. yes. Use try, all, try. use all the observations you have, and make up an answer. Go ahead. These yes. These people, these people don't understand. We never said it doesn't work on a flat Earth. We said we don't know how it operates on a flat Earth. There's a difference. We just don't make the claim. What's the about. difference? What's the difference? The difference is you make a positive claim on how it works, so you should back it up. Okay, but hold, hold oh, on. So how does it work on, on a flat earth? earth? Let's not get past the first bit there was when he said that it works the same it does as it does on the globe Earth. On our yeah, exactly. Model. There are spheres. There are spheres. Uh, There's big amount of space exactly, between. Jose, There's right? orbits. You saw, yeah. you saw it. So the shadow that's cast on. onto the moon which is yes. how it works on the globe model, is a spherical object in nature, and then you... While orbiting, said, yeah, orbiting, yeah. Yeah, and you Changing said words, that it works the same words. way it yeah, does yeah, on the, the same. globe. Yeah, yeah, it's the same. So, so it's a sphere, he just your... wanted to <laughs> say it's flat, yeah. He just wanted to say it's flat. Yeah. Yeah. Just and no, now, no. when you realize that you're in a trap, you she say, we don't make a claim of how it works, but you claim in the beginning it worked the same. Hey, guys, 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 we really need to do... We really need to make this one at a time, okay? Let's do our best not to talk over each other. Flat soil, can you turn your microphone up a little bit? Turn it up. Yeah, you are a bit low, flat soil, F.E. You're a bit low on your microphone it, there. It would help if whoever the one is could get to the point and make it. Just try yes, to be quick that, about that's, it. That's, that's a very valid point. That's if make they your had point I think quick. I made the point quite quickly. And concise. Yeah, if they had a Already. point. Already. don't have a point. That's why you're The point around. was, Chemo, the point was is that he claimed that he, yes, he observed them. So therefore, I asked for a mechanism that explains it on a flat earth. He then said, then said, it's how it works on the globe Earth. And how it works on the globe is a spherical uh, shadow is cast on the moon. So if that's not how it works, explain how it works. If you don't know how it works, say I don't know. Uh, people, can he respond? Is that all right? He's responding now. Go ahead, Flatsoid. Respond, please. Thank you. 
I said, that's not what I said. So I stopped changing my words around. I said, we observe live on a flat earth. That I never said it worth. I said it works. Sorry, like sorry to interrupt, flat sword. You break flat sword. Flat sword, really sorry to interrupt. It's difficult to hear you, you and it's difficult to make sense of what you're saying, yeah, even when good. your microphone's loud. So if you made your microphone loud, at least we could hear your nonsense a bit more clearly. Can oh, you, you please turn your mic up? As well. Yeah, I want to test my microphone. Is it you're really good, loud Jose. now, or is it better yeah. now? Yeah, better no, you're yeah. good, Jose. You're good. You're, you're, very, you're very strong, indeed. I post an image of the lunar eclipse in the side chat. One doesn't look like <laughs> look right for some reason. Go go, go ahead, flat so Let's test your microphone now. Flat soid, you there? No, if you're talking, at the, you're, you're he's muted. looking at the image and trying to trying to figure out which one represents reality the best: the one in the left or the one in the right from the terrorist picture. One. That's on what he's doing. Looking at it. Can can you navigate the oh, debate no. chat box, Flatso? Yeah, my English is not very good okay, looking. Has, right. I'll help you. And I still I still did I still kick your ass every single time that I'm, you uh, attempt to to say anything, Kim. It's fine. I'm, I'm, I wasn't. I was helping you. Helping you. We anyway, seem to yeah, have lost so flat soid The one on the right, um, flat soid is. I mean, obviously, the one on the left is not reality because we don't say the Earth is flat like this. Okay, you would need a giant, like, body of Earth covering the bottom half of that moon. Then again, we don't even know how thick the Earth is. No one, nobody knows these. Nobody even knows. Before we know, we think there's a black sun or a black moon or a black but, body in the sky covering that called Ra. Kim, Rahu. Kim, yeah. you're on point. Let's cut this in, in, unnecessary rambling short here real quick so you can address the actual issue. How the fuck does the Earth get between the sun and the moon it in your doesn't. system? It That's doesn't. what it you doesn't. fuckers have got to answer. It doesn't. It Tell doesn't. him that side. Not even in your model it doesn't. Right. Okay. The impossible eclipse. You're trying to get us to answer a straw man curve. No, Nobody no, said no, 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 I'm not. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. But we do need you to put the microphone closer to your ass, Vlad. So wait, I still cannot hear you. Can you hear and me? I've though? got you at two hundred percent. Can you hear me though? Is that all right? Am I clear? Yeah, you can. We can hear you way too much, Spurs. We need to hear flat soy more. <laughs> okay, go on. Yeah, I mean, all the mods. We can hear all the mods way too much. <laughs> all need to shut the fuck up, Branch, or we're not going to hear you. Say I'm something saying... useful. No, God this damn it. If it's you, not the Earth, well. what's causing this shadow platoid? Hey, I'm just saying we can hear you, bitches. Yeah, yeah good branch. on you, Branch. Thanks, Branch. Thanks hey, for the mic you check. You guys chill the fuck out and let we, people in the room. We got your mic check, Branch. Branch, I'm going to have you hey, blacklisted you have from every goddamn check. alcohol delivery site in Texas. Hey, all I'm trying to say is... Mute you. I can hear you. Right, Branch, I'm not having what? this. Go, go, go Come ahead, on, Platzoid. Answer the go question, Platzoid. Quit dragging yeah, it out, ahead. Princess. Answer the question. What the fuck's causing the shadow? He's not going to answer. He say, I say, he, See, we this is flat earth. And he, no, he won't he answer because like, everyone keeps no, jumping yeah, in exactly. when he's got a chance to answer. Aggressive curves, he's muted. Like if he unmuted himself, but he hasn't even unmuted himself. He's no, still really? Give him a minute. Give him a minute. He might be shy. No. Are you sure, Flatsoid? No, he's not sure. Why should he talk if he's... He might be trying to work out his volume level so he can be a bit louder. Possibly that as well. Curved is asking rather aggressive, and um, I wouldn't even understand. Don't, don't, don't worry about the tone. Worry about... Try the answering, Kimo, and it won't have to come to that. Well, uh, we said it's uh, not the... I'm earth. sick of dancing with you little bitches about shit like this. Stop acting like you're doing something. Fucking do it. Answer a fucking question. Just do it. That's all. When you're ready, mate. That's not it. What is causing it? The answer is not what's not causing it. How fucking retarded are you, you dipshit? Right, and yeah, heard? I'm gonna be. I'm gonna act like this. If you're gonna act like you're acting, have you heard? Platoid. Have you? Heard you lying fuckwits. Have you heard of Rahu? Rahu. Give me evidence of Rahu. Um, well, I don't actually have... And tell me what your Christian God thinks about your Indian religion shit. I know. That's what I mean. I just heard about it. 
just heard about it. You but, didn't uh, just heard about it. You can't say a goddamn sentence without lying. You did not just hear about it. Yeah, I've heard about it. I don't know what how true it is, though. You're asking what is covering the sun. Nobody it's, knows. So it's the answer. You don't. You don't even know how true it. You don't even know that this is the answer. All right, let let Flatsword answer it then. I don't know. It'd be Rahu. Yeah, because you got nothing. Rahu sounds good to me. Okay, can I ask a question about Rahu? I don't know anything about Rahu. I just heard that it was Rahu. Okay. Then why does it sound good to you? It, makes sense. it must have been for a very, it's, yeah, it's for a Rahu, source he trusts. It's Rahu and Ketu. Sorry. It's Rahu and Ketu. And by the way, on a flat earth, the sun and moon are not tangible. So they're just their own light sources. So they don't need anything to cover them. It's just the phases they go through. Yeah. Phases. So, we're not, um, we're in the dark just like you guys are in the dark. We're in the wiser. You don't know. We don't know. You don't talk to you like that. What is it? What is it? What's going on? Explain the, explain the moon. You know, nobody knows. My young man, hot mic. Who's hot mic in? My young man. I'm not. Someone. Shut up, fucking you goon. No, you are hot mic in my. Putting us off. Uh, yeah, it was. It was fucking annoying. <laughs> Sorry, it's true. <laughs> No, no, again, we don't know, do Again, Curved is just demanding an answer. What is it? What is it? What's covering it? And we're like, well, dude, how are we supposed to know? No one's even been up there. No, these no. All right, hold on, hold on. Let's not get past your point you just made. Okay, that's your claim. We don't, you know, light sources, all the rest of it, phases of the moon. Why are solar eclipses not seen in both southern locations and northern locations at the same time? Where's Jeremy? He'll know this one. Might be busy. Kind of throws a spanner in there, so it just kind of feels like doing it in one side of the world, but not the other, yet it's meant to be circling above. Try harder. Yeah, we're throwing your tools back in your, in your works, whatever it is. I mean, a lot of these things, sheeple, um, can't be... No, 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 I expect an answer to my question. Oh, give me an honest answer that nobody knows these No, no, things. no, no, you're about to evade and go around why you don't have to answer it. Not why I we know don't have you, to Kimo. answer it, but we, nobody has... Why answer. is it separate in the North Hemisphere, Northern Hemisphere and the Southern Hemisphere? Why don't we see the eclipse on the same day, and why don't we see it at all here in the South if it's in the North? Come on. If it's oh, just meant to be the lights in the phases, why is it different? Angle. Be because of limited angle. Because of limited angle. Limited angle go. from a light source. There you go. Limited angle. What more do you want? What more do you need? Oh, just so, it just happens to be that the sun is in perfect alignment with the earth and the moon at the same time. But that's not it. That's not any... That has no bearing on your answer. Yeah, what's causing the limited angle? Look, me and Flat Sword and Jerry, we can't build a model for you. You've got to build it yourself. So then you're holding on to a reification fallacy by oh, saying yeah. the Earth is flat. No, no, we're going to go by what we measure. Well, we got a model. We got a model with plausible, you know, predictive capabilities. Well, You've got, got we've got a, a statement. The Earth is flat because it looks flat. We've well, got... then make a model of it. Model it out for us. Make a replica. Scale got a... it down. Got a measurement. Got no measurements. The measurements um, you use are globe mathematics. What's the length of the tropics, Kimo? Give me your measurements. The length of the tropics. Um, we measured that. I don't think anyone's measured that. What we have measured. So you don't, you don't have the measurements. We've managed to measure small local areas. What do you think? People are like giants who can measure vast distances or something. That'd be silly. Only back in the days of you, giants you were able to measure giants. You demand it of us, Kimo. What do we demand? No, we just ask for the science. If it's not there, it's not there. To move on. No, no, you know, you demand it of us. Yeah, if it's not there, it's not there. We can't force you to give us something. That's what Steve said. If it's not there, it's not there. Yeah, so if it's not there, it's not there. We can't force you to extract information if it's not there, right? And we know there's no globe evidence to support the claim, only flat Earth observations. That's all we have. We observe flat, we measure. Oh, we can measure it as well. We have measurements as well, yeah. Have a horizontal plane. 
no drop Wait. from yes speed. Well, I was going to ask, where does the moon go during a new moon on a flat Earth? It's meant to disappear for three days or something. Just asking. I was never really into astrology stuff like that because um, I was at astrology, astronomy, astrology, whatever well, you want, whatever it is, whatever. Looking at the stars, sky, moon, all that stuff. Me. I never really. Um, I don't see the point in looking at all. Explain in the Bible what it is, so I just take it as that. Unless obviously let, you have more information to say not that. But let me no, I'm for him. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. If it's the, the own, light, just turns off. Light, if if it, if it's its own light, why does it need to be there for three days? God turns it off for three days. Maybe it's just regenerating. You never know. Hey, Talking huh? about the mysteries of God's creation. Which, I mean. Wait. Did Flatsoy say that the moon turns off? I think he was asking me because, like, it's, oh, it lights itself. I don't know. I don't know if he was asking me. I don't know who he was. Asking. No, no, that was me. I was asking. I was just saying. I know exactly what happens. If it's a light source, the light just turns off. So I, I have a question. How is it that during a, a solar eclipse? How is it that during a solar eclipse, we never see the moon anywhere around the world? Never. Is it just a coincidence that we can't see the moon while there is a, anywhere while there is a solar eclipse? Yeah, but how do you know this? Because you're looking at the moon. That's recorded uh, history, though. Know? That's, the the does... That's what the model says, yeah? No, 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 no. That's recorded. Recorded? Who's been recording this? throughout history the moon was never seen the mormons anywhere around the world did you say the mormons well, have been recording well, this throughout history sorry did say the mormons photograph who's pho who's doing all these photographs why are you asking there are people still, that have photographed the moon during the solar eclipse well, you're saying that people are doing all these things who what where are you just making things up you can see the face of the moon in the photograph yeah, but he's saying like you can't see something, something where, and I'm like, how do you know? Been everywhere to know. I don't, I don't know by uh, first-hand observation. Let's talk about the things that we do know for sure that we can practically demonstrate. What can we practically demonstrate? Today? So we're going to deny that. Uh, never can we demonstrate that the can we demonstrate that the sun is never out at night? The sun is always out in daytime. That's that's a fact. We all observe that. Is it the same It's sun? a good step, good start. Yeah, we've got a lot to learn. Well, at least you guys have got a lot to learn about your reality. But it's a good start, right? The sun is always out at daytime. I'm not talking about which sun, if there's one, two, mm -hmm. or 25. The sun is always out at daytime, yeah, yeah, never yeah, out at, at your nighttime. All right, we know that, yeah. So we know the that. moon is always out at night. I mean, the moon is most of the time out at night, sometimes <laughs> at daytime, time. and for three days is nowhere to what? be seen so why is the moon why did the moon challenge god's word when he said the the lesser light is for the to rule the night but the moon just challenged that because he goes out at date sometimes it's not even there what's going on what when you say it's that? not the there. sun is following god's rules but the moon is not why when you say the moon is not there what what do you mean exactly you say we say so where's the moon for three days uh -huh. is it turns off, flat so it said, or something like that, like a switch off. It, it, it just disappears. Yeah, but what do you mean? Is it goes off the flat plane or something? I get uh, that. That's what you got to tell us what happens with the moon. Well, my question is why is the moon going against God's rules, which is which you are very strong with it? Well, because if the sun is to rule the day, the moon is to rule the night. What is the moon out at daytime, daytime sometimes? Okay, look, I'm not arguing against... I'm saying, where is the evidence that the moon disappears? Who's, how, does that, how do we know this information? Where do we get this from? Jose, oh, of the moon I I and the sun, which one rules the day? The sun never comes out at night, so the sun Let's rules the, the day. Question. It's always which one out rules the day? Moon or sun? Always out at daytime, the sun. Okay, which one rules the night? Moon or sun? It's not the sun, but not necessarily the moon, because the moon is which half one of the of time the two daytime, rules the night? out on daytime. Moon or sun? Neither. What, neither. Neither of them. 
neither of them rule. Which yeah, way? Yeah, neither of them rule because the moon is out day, the night, all this stuff. So the moon and sun are even in terms of the night. No, yeah, uh, no, evenly? no. The moon, the moon is not Fantastic. the sun. The sun is always out at, at daytime, only Fantastic. at daytime. So God was right. This is a very poor Poe-like line of questioning. God's never the out. The sun's never out as at expected. Night. The, the sun is never out at night, and uh, it, it's always out during the day. So what is the Ex point of this? But the moon um, is also out see, at day, in the daytime too. They don't. They don't. We can't help what you guys don't understand. Our limited angle works. Jeremy, it's just limited angle. He's saying there because the moon sometimes is in <laughs> during the day that it doesn't rule the night. Well, actually, the sun is out at twenty-four hours. I mean, wouldn't you consider some of that nighttime? What? What? what you really? You see the sun out at night? <laughs> yes. What about I, the midnight? Sun? The what about the midnight sun, sun, Jeremy? What about the midnight? What about the midnight what? sun, Jeremy? What limit an angle? What's the midnight yeah. sun? Is that night? Oh, that's a good point. Good mm. point so the sun does come out at night. But is it nighttime if it's not dark? Yeah, but it is. It's night. It should be night. It? But people come out at midnight Only to see the, the sun. Clock. Only on the night clock. comes just, after sunset, Kimo. It's just a yeah, this time. Yeah, when, when does the sun come out at night? The midnights yeah. at midnight. It's it's uh, almost, and you claim, is this a fact, Timo? Is day this a fact? where the sun is ah, up. Ah, because uh, Jose didn't know about, didn't know about this. You didn't know about the midnight sun, did you, Jose? Hey? Timo, the, the midnight sun, the midnight sun is, but that's not nighttime. The sun is Is that up. is that fact, Kimo? The, 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 is there a midnight sun? So ah, that's true, right? Uh, Jose didn't know this, yeah. did you, Jose? And hey? like in, in, uh, in Antarctica, you can see the 24-hour sun too, right? Is that a fact? Yes, now, in it's Nor a fact. In, in Norway, you can see the midnight sun. Jose. In Antarctica also. Uh, there's I don't know about Antarctica. Yeah, for Norway is always there. With 24 hours like sun, that. yes? Antarctica? I don't, know about, Norfolk, I don't know about Antarctica. I just know that in All Norway. All right, but Kimo, if you are going to invoke a midnight sun, then you got to explain how that's possible on a flat Earth. I mean, that's normal. That's how, but how on a flat Earth? Circling above All right, the do it, plane. That's easy. Do it. How, how, how do you have a sun till midnight? Flat Earth. It circles above the flat plane. It. Oh, what what's that happening in Antarctica? How how does you that work in that? Antarctica? Yeah, how come it only works in Antarctica and you know it doesn't happen in, in exactly. New York? Exactly, you don't get a midnight sun in the south, right, do you? It happens you in do. the north. Yes, yes it, it does. does. Show me midnight sun. You guys just got to be patient. Well. Listen, it happens in the south as well. But Jeremy, go ahead, man. Show me midnight sun in the south. Yeah, it happens. Jeremy, go ahead. Nate, you just lie. Exactly. Where's the midnight sun in the sun? Yo, yo, can you let Jeremy speak? Hey, can you let Jeremy answer? <laughs> of course. God damn. <laughs> the, the midnight sun happens in the north, in the Arctic. That's explain, fully explainable on a, on a flat plane, the sun circling above a flat plane. We know the sun's doing circles. Oh, I showed you 14 days plane. of midnight sun. And now the second half on Antarctica, what happened? Antarctica is the bit. The bit I don't, Mar Mar Moyak's mumbling through Right, I showed you 14 days of that, didn't I? Or did you not look at your DM? Antarctica. Also, Kimo, I just tagged like you with the, with the... Jeremy doesn't Wikipedia respond when he tries to slide into so, his DMs. So, um, Kimo, <laughs> the midnight sun is a natural phenomenon that occurs in the summer months in places north of the Arctic Circle or south of the... Antarctic Circle. So it happens in the South Pole. Where is the South then? Let's have a look. It's debatable. I, I just tagged you with Southern the Antarctic. Wikipedia on it. Like, no, um, show that, the video. The no, the research no. of the claim. Show us evidence. I, 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 I don't want to show you a video. I, I, just, I, 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 evidence. I feel Jeremy, this is enough evidence. Jeremy, send yeah. you the video. Yeah, Moyo can send. Yeah. But, but, two of them. But the chemo and Jeremy, Jeremy, you're going to piggyback your claim onto Moyox's evidence without yeah, even because we're a team. The way y'all working together, that's with trust, man. Why can't I work with I him? I trust him. <laughs> you don't know Moyox. Days, uh, <laughs> about, you know, yes. I showed you 14 days of the sun at about 45 degrees or whatever. I'm not sure. Yeah, up in the sky, pretty high. Then I showed you 14 days of it hovering right on the horizon. Of course you did, Moyox. Of course you did. But Nate, show Yo, us this Jeremy, 24 hours in the Jeremy, south. I, is, is that yeah, true? Moyog yeah. sent it to, to Jeremy. Jeremy's going to post it in a bit. Of course he is. Sit tight, Jake, don't have it right hey, now. Kimo, you guys have Kimo to, call me a liar again. I'm fucking coming over there and I'm going to kill you. He can <laughs> oh my god, Moyog. 
Settle down, man. You know, yeah, you know, guys. How dare you ghost his DMs, Jeremy? You guys, open, you have you, you have you been explaining. You have been explaining you sent me the... something, and I and I open it on accident, and then I, it got lost in the shuffle. I mean, you just have to repost it if you want to post it. Oh, it's still in there. It's still in there. I see it. I'm in your DMs right now. Yeah. Oh, if you see it, then po just post it for these guys. Guys, what? you have been explaining the 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 twenty twelve hours, twenty four hours sun on the north uh, hemisphere. Uh, you flat earthers have, have, have explained it uh, that can you tell me on which model did, what what model did you use it to explain it we're not flat earthers we're level earthers with uh elevation changes. okay 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 which model did you use it for the, this explanation <laughs> i don't know about you i'm a flat what? horizoner okay. which model did level, you use it for this explanation level earth with her it's level with with elevation change earther. guys you explain it something Here without the model what my model, model meshes what is this earth troll so stationary much stationary her uh, straight why, horizon why, mesh. Why, why, why are you guys again? like this? why are you guys troll again? so much Nate, Black you're just horizon. making noise. You're not uh, progressing the conversation. We're talking about the mid Yeah, I mean, I mean, Jeremy's just throwing out jokes. Seen. Come on. Come on, Jeremy. Now look at the fucking video that you That's could have thought of. Because you're a fucking cunt. That's how the Earth's represented. I mean, it's a flat level plane with he or, uh, elevation changes. And when you follow so, that video out, you're going to see several videos of it. So, I mean, there are plenty of videos out there, man. Why do you guys uh, uh, deny it? Chemo, are you seeing his video with his 18 days of Antarctic? You need to see the Midnight Sun in the South, like they claimed. He said he just posted one. Midnight Sun? Which country? Yeah, he said he just posted 14 days of it. Which country after. is that supposed to be? Antarctica, cut. Uh, that's a continent. What? Uh, why does that matter? Ah, uh, you see? Cause it's in Norway. But why does that matter, Kimo? Kimo, why does that matter? Because she's a lying sack of shit. No one's been there to see this 24 hours. Oh my god. What, do you have a full 24 hours off this set? <laughs> There's more. No 14 days, 24 hours oh, is one day. That's many, many weeks. more days than that, Kimo. How about okay. that? Yeah, you got more one than you asked Check for. It oh, Check cool, it out. Check it out, Kimo. Go big or go home, Kimo. We'll tear this up in a, in a matter of minutes, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah, we're going to just say no. Uh, <laughs> I, uh, I, I, I don't believe you're saying all of this with a straight face, man. Bro, they, you know their evidence snap. Nate, you know their evidence is super flimsy. We tear this shit apart. And if sometimes it takes minutes. Sometimes it takes a few days. We're going to get our think tanks on it, and we work this shit out. Yeah, yeah. you just got wrecked by lunar eclipses in front of everybody. And yeah, that was, that was the thing. Oh, yeah, but you don't even know how they work. By the way, the lunar eclipse thing was a bit embarrassing. That was a bit embarrassing. Go on, I dare you to explain how they work in your model. There's also 14 days of moon in there. They're just uh, for fucking uh, kicks and giggles. The lunar eclipse argument got so bad, Kimo wasn't even willing to back the other flat earth. Well, That's so bad. Argument, substantiation, you okay? And validation. Like, like, like Kimo, like, just left him, you know? Kimo, they don't hanging even out have to an argument. They don't even have an argument. They Kimo haven't even got a 24-hour video, Jeremy. They yeah. can't... Yeah, they can't prove this, how the sky works, so it's, it ends right there. Do you have a 24-hour video at the North Pole that you've seen, Kimo? Uh, no. There's, there's so why, why do you believe that one, but not the one at the South? Kimo, Kimo, and Jeremy, no don't there. click on that it's link. just up the road from me. It's just up the no road. Norway's just up the road. We can just it, go up there and see. There's flat earthers that actually believe there's no 24 hours sun at the North Pole. Do not like click on the Vimeo link I posted. And for those flat earthers, they can request to see the evidence. There it is. There it is. The 24 hours sun. Do not click on the link that I posted of Vimeo. Do not click on the flat earthers. Yeah, there seems to be a 24-hour sun in the, in the south. Damn, he just posted Christ. it. Yeah. All right, so there you have Unlike it, Kimo. 24-hour sun at the south. At the south pole, bro. Oh, now, can you or Jeremy explain mm -hmm. how this happens on a flat well, earth? video, so let me take a look. Oh, you should have Jeremy, been looking at I can't even watch it right now. What, Jose? Yeah, he, you don't have to watch it, but it I'll was watch it in a bit. There. So Jose's you can video, see it whenever. Yeah.
We'll see his video, yeah. Okay. But the evidence is there, Jeremy. So how does this happen on the flat Earth? At the north and at the south. But we'll deem if it's actually evidence. Well, well, no, but your, this your is the north. Question, Nate, this is the Arctic. Your real question should be. Hold on. How do you know this is Nate, the south? Your real question should be. Nate, your real question should be. How does the sky work? Now I can't answer that, and neither can you. So it ends right there. So That's Jose's right. video shows the North Pole. How do you know it's the South Pole? You just ran away from the question, fam. Come Jose, on. how do you know this is the, the South? Jose is the yeah. South. Because it says it's the South. Where? Do they, so, Where do does they it show say themselves the leaving like the tip of Where does it say? Where does Argentina it say in the South? or some shit? Where does it say that, Kimo? It's in the South. Where does it say it? No, because we're talking about 24 hours so in the South, Jose. Yeah, but Kimo, oh, if you go to the actual page of the video, it says there. I'm watching now what the sun does at the pole. Yeah, North Pole, we know go. this. Yeah. No big deal. So. Does it happen in the south? Why do I keep hearing Northern Hemisphere bias? We know everything yeah, happens why in the do north. You, why do you believe it happens at the Northern Hemisphere, not the south? We're in the north. Since, what do you want about? We Kimo, live here. Kimo, you just, said, you just admitted you've never seen a 24-hour video. No. Of a 24 hour sun at no. the North Pole. No, but no. why do you believe it I happens? Have. Oh, he has, yeah. He yeah, has, but, yeah, but but Kimo has, but Kimo oh, believes it happens. Yeah, why does he why? believe that one and not the ones from the South? Why? It's yeah, just up why, the road. Kimo? We can go and look at it any time, not a big deal. Also, the South. Oh, you the, the Southern Pole, a lot of people have done it. What you don't have to do yeah. anything, Kimo. No, no, many people yeah. have shown the Northern Norway midnight sun. Uh, and many and people many have people shown have the shown South, the South in Antarctica. And Southern, yeah. How? How do you know they're in the south? The selenium, uh, How? They go with a camera, they do a 24 hours time lapse, and then they put a YouTube or Vimeo and they show it to us. That's how, Kimo. So that could be anywhere, yeah. Jose. Anywhere. Well, they said, well, so everything can be, right? You just trust whoever you decide to trust? Well, if you've got Norwegians, oh. talk on Norwegian, saying we're in Norway, talking Norwegian, look at this Norwegian land and this Norwegian <laughs> how sun. Do, how do you determine who to trust and not? How, how do you choose that? Because they show Norwegian. Are you the arbiter of truth? No. If they're yes, showing... for himself. Yes. Everyone's the arbiter of truth for themselves. We all have our, you know... So why is he attempting to tell us? Why is he attempting to tell us? Then we must we must see and choose and accept what he decides when he is his own arbiter of truth. He's not my arbiter. You don't have to. That's why you're globe earther. If you had to choose and accept what he accepted, then you'd be a flat earther, and you would have the same exact thoughts as him. No, I'll be a liar and disingenuous and uneducated if I accept what he's saying. Kimo asked for evidence, was given evidence, and then denied the evidence. I haven't denied He's it. asking asked... for verifiability, yeah. for validity that this is evidence for the claim that it was, you know, supposed to substantiate. No one's denying anything. Was saying, hey. Yeah, you, know, you did, Kimo. You, you just said. What? what? You just said, oh, well, since it's not Norwegian speaking Norwegian, then, uh, then obviously it's fake. Strong I man. didn't say that. He asked about how would you know it's in Norway. Now, how do we know that's in the South Pole? Where are the South Pole speaking people? Not really, but how can you verify it's in the South? <laughs> So that was your whole thing. Well, just because somebody it's a valid can speak question. A, a certain language. Not really. How do you, you verify that they're in the South anywhere Pole? Anywhere on Earth. Speaking Norwegian to other Norwegians, and they could be anywhere on Earth. But that doesn't address the issue. That's a red herring. How do you uh, like, validate, validate, <laughs> validate sorry, that they're in the South? Mm. Did they leave Argentina, Australia, South Africa? How do we know they headed that direction how how does a percentage know that the 24 video you saw at the north pole was from the north pole well the one that i saw was like a little time lapse and the person was um in alaska they weren't at the north pole and they're how showing you know they were, the sun. They were in alaska how do you know they were in alaska because they were showing like different scenery and background and stuff like that uh-huh. Could you post that video? There, there's a bunch of video videos showing the midnight yeah, guys, guys, I'm going to post a comment in the debate chat, just a moment, of the guy that uh, produced this video. And I'm going to show you what he wrote. Just a second. It doesn't matter what he wrote, man. It's what he can actually show. Exactly. You guys have papers upon papers upon papers. Oh, this, papers. Is, this is what he wrote. Yeah, but how can you verify that he's in the south? 
just because he said so. Don't you know that there's a read, deception? Read what there? he wrote, otherwise the sun would go from left to right. First of all, even if he is in the south, you don't know how the sky works. I don't understand. This isn't even yeah, an argument. Uh, you can't va validate or verify anything you're saying about how the sky works. Jeremy, Jeremy. I understand the argument. Jeremy, I understand it. But but right now we're talking in different contexts. I mean, yeah, I understand this argument. There is no argument. You don't have an argument. No, Jeremy. I understand your argument. What do you mean there is an argument? Just saying, I understand this, your argument. This 24 hour sun thing in Antarctica, there's no argument with this. Why? This isn't an argument. Why? Because it's a, it's a natural phenomena that is observed by people. You can't argue against it. Now, you cannot explain the mechanism on how it works if the Earth was not a sphere, which is the only way it works. But it's okay, you, you, can, you can just sweep it under the rug like you do with most of the stuff. We're not even arguing against it, we're asking for validation of it. So, you by your standards, so let, let me tell you, by your standards, uh, the only way to validate is to actually go there. If I told you eyes. Jesus walked on water, what would you ask me for? Let's find out. What would you ask? Hmm? Hmm? What? If More I evidence you, besides one source. If More I said evidence to you, besides one if I source. Said you got you, one source. If I said to you that Jesus Kimo, walked on water. I'm telling you. Kimo, I'm answering you. You ask a question, I'm going to answer you. Oh, okay. What do I need to believe that Jesus walked in water? I need more than one source. The one source that you have is the Bible. I need more than need that more. one source. And then so I might I take it in consideration. Yeah, essentially, Go ahead. you need more. What I'm offering is not enough. Now, you're offering me the same. You're offering me somebody's word. Many sources. You've been shown from many different sources, Kimo. Yeah, but I could show you the many different versions of the Bible. You would say it's from No, the only source. source you got of that claim of Jesus uh -huh. is in the Bible. That's the only one source. Yes, but we've got, um, what's his name? Josephus. Bullshit. You got, You've only got people got one that read source. the Bible. Exactly. The people that so the Bible that's my it. point. So people read your Bible, copied it, and said, look, there's the information. Everybody's copying the information, makes it true. No, that's not how it works. Many people have seen the 24 hour sun, and many people have documented documented it on them on their own on themselves and they have posted in many different ways shapes of form yeah, many different pole. people don't have to do one to another you can literally pole, take a so cruise to the south pole and see it yourself that's not true you and it's, really that's what i'm that's cruise. what i'm asked for and there should for be a lot of evidence for schema. it just like the north pole there is there's more there evidence, of the the evidence for the, north the south pole there's plenty of evidence for the south pole there's more than four which the bible's only got four no, no, there's more, there's more even witnesses. But what's the difference even between even evidence for the North Pole that. and the South Pole? So, you want to even show that, that GPS-wise that you've They got cannot accept that the South Pole South America, is, is a thing South Africa, because it destroyed the South flutter. Australia and show that you they have... They have to deny it with their heart and soul. So, so is on Kimo, a crazy point, order here, point of order here, Kimo. <laughs> Josephus didn't say that Jesus walked on water. Jesus, I'm say Josephus said that there are a group of people who call themselves Christians who believed that there was a character, Citation. gave a name, who arose from the dead three days later. Citation. Just go, go look at Josephus. Oh, yeah, just go, just go, just go. Now, look, what we're looking for... That's what for... Josephus actually said. Yeah, okay, citation, no citation. All right, I don't believe that Jesus walked on water. Citation, Kimo. Exactly, you need more. Okay, I can get... No, let me see your citation. That Jesus I can cite water. the Bible. The citation. I can cite the Give Bible. It to me. I can cite the Bible. It's not enough for you. So you, well, need, you need Post more. it, post it, post it. Come on, citation, please. Oh, you want the Bible verse? Right? Okay. No citation. I want I want the uh, timestamp and I want a, maybe a versicle, a, a chapter. Just tell me where to find it. So you see how ferocious you are asking me for more than just the word. I give you a citation of the 24 hours on Timo on the internet. Moya, you need you're to telling me the Bible noise. to find that information. I tell you on the internet you find the information you're looking for. Moya, you're making a lot of noise. You need to stop. I'm just. Well, Kimo, I don't understand why you think there's a 24-hour sun in the north. You don't have evidence enough. Um. Well, I mean, again, for that by your standard, it's um, it's it's obvious. Uh, it's a given, isn't it? Obviously, um, people have recorded it. Obviously, that's, that's not your standard of evidence. No, but uh, yeah, not millions. In, the north is not in contention. We, the south is. Yeah, we have we have millions. Yeah, of but your standard of evidence we is not consistent. Tons of recordings of it uh, show me the north, north 24 hour sun is not 
like Kimo said. Can you can you show us one, Jeremy, that like meets your standard of evidence? That's not a video. That's it doesn't like, matter, bro. He's free to reject whatever claim he wants and ask for the evidence for it. So he's, That's fine. But he's, he's rejecting the South claim. His standard. It's none of your like... business if he rejects the North or not. Yeah, what, but that, all that, that matters that he is has that no the person that makes the claim evidence, and should you. substantiate yeah, but, it and be but, intellectually but, honest. But, That's but, it. I do have a consistent but, standard. He needs to set a standard of, of evidence that he's willing to accept. Right? Yeah, as long as he's consistent with his intellectual honesty in terms of actually evaluating the evidence and stuff, that's fine. But it's his it's his prerogative what he wants to like, you know, contend. Yes, I'm showing he's inconsistent. Percentage. Yeah, but percentage. He needs to create a consistent standard so that we know what kind of evidence to bring to bring to him. Yeah, he's he's right he now. doesn't really need fine, to. If some people want to, the be... other kind of evidence isn't fine. He creates a double standard. Then we don't know right, what. How's to my mic sound now? Am I Hold good? Up. Sounds good, Jeremy. Yeah, you sound fine. You good? But, Sorry, Jeremy. Go ahead. Go ahead. Jeremy. All right, Let me just say something quick, Jeremy. People's eyewitness testimony okay, fine. in the north. We have millions of people's of eyewitness testimony in the north. We have thousands and thousands of video. What do you got from the south? A couple videos, two that we debunked. How, what what millions thousands of people have of been to the North Pole, south. Jeremy? Millions of people have yeah. viewed this this twenty four hour sun in the north. How do you know millions. that? Millions. How do you know that? Because millions of people live sure? there and they see it all the time. Yeah, Are you I'm sure? sure? Have you? Yeah, I'm sure. Have you spoken to them? How many people live above the Arctic Circle? Millions. Citation not, needed. That's not true, Jeremy. Come on. It doesn't matter. Millions. Do you know how difficult it is to live above the Arctic Circle? Are, are you we just talking about believing this because you, you read it in a book, Jeremy? Twenty-four-hour northern. Are we talking about the place you can view the twenty-four-hour northern sun from? Yeah, that's above the Arctic Circle. Don't you know? Yeah, you millions know? of people live above that. Citation are needed, you sure, Jeremy. Jeremy. Let's look into it. Just yeah, somebody go get the numbers, whatever. It's not mil millions of people. Yeah, Jeremy just said millions of people. If millions of people have seen it throughout history, not millions or even billions people. Live Quadrillions. Above. Yeah, millions of people have navigated using celestial navigation based on the globe. So. What's, what's your point? Oh, they have it. Nah, so, based on a apparently, you yeah. when you only, say millions hang on, hang on. Yeah. people, apparently, only four million people live above the Arctic Circle, and most of them are indigenous people. Okay, well, are they billions? Yeah. Is that, is are that, they so, posting so on the internet? Like it's mostly, you represent as it's mostly billions of people. Is that, is that accurate? Yeah, that but accurate? it's mostly Eskimos that, 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 that live above there, Jeremy. So, we're based on Alaska. Do you know P900s and whatnot? And cameras. Well, Russia, Alaska. Iceland. Where else are we talking about? Besides, Jeremy, you can just go to the the, the Antarctic Circle yourself on a cruise and see it. I mean, it's it's there's there's no secret. There's nothing stopping you. I mean, you no, haven't gone above the Arctic Circle yourself, have see, you? You guys need to figure this shit That's out. Shifting bro. the burden of proof. Don't don't, don't just throw. No, I'm just illustrating the double there, standard bro. that you guys present. There's no double standard. Yeah, there is a double standard. You say that video doesn't count, and then you say video does count. What video? The, from the 24-hour sun in the south. Well, I haven't had a look, chance to look at it, but Chemo seems like he looked Have at it chance? and there was no, what's called, validation that they were actually in the South. So then you could say the same thing for any video in the North. could do that, but show us the validation for the South. Not for any video. No, but you could argue that if you yeah, wanted you to, but the point There's is... There's videos you're in the North where they substantiate they're in the North. How would they oh. do that? Yeah. By showing the scenery, the direction, you know, showing something else. The direction the of scenery. Travel, what, yeah, what's the, the direction scenery is in the moon video? Yeah. What, what, like what there's, did they show percentage? Like if there's specific buildings, you know, like and you hop on Google Maps and you can, you know, see that the, this store is next to this thing or whatever. Yeah. You can it's somewhere in Alaska or in design. Nunavut or what have you. Percent. Uh, what about the direction of travel of the sun and the moon? What does that matter? Uh, that tells you which direction it is, dumbass. It's always going to say no geometry. Of course, he's going to ask that. It's always in the same direction. Yeah, it is. Okay, so if I'm in the southern hemisphere, why does the moon set to my left if I'm looking at it? But if I'm in the northern hemisphere, the moon sets to the right, right. when I'm looking at it. Because you're looking at it from an opposite side. Yeah. Okay. To the left so the right direction of, of travel would happen. The direction of travel of the thing is still going to be east to west. 
Right, but that's going to be either on your left or on your right, depending on where you are. So you can tell by the video if they're in the north or the south. Thank you. Welcome to Google How do you know whether they're facing north or south? Because it's substantiated the same way that you say someone has substantiated a video in the wow. north. Sad. The same way. Same Busted. logic. Unless you have a double standard. I mean, go ahead. I told you. You oh, look at the buildings and stuff. I didn't say, you know, you look buildings at the direction and stuff that at they're the north facing pole? and without knowing what direction they're facing. So how, I mean, all this could be applied to any proof that you claim for the sun in the north. Because there's no buildings in the North Pole. There's buildings in Alaska and in Nunavut in places where you can see the midnight sun. Supposedly. They could be a green screen, according to your logic. Wow. Like, there's an airport in, like, right off the tip of uh, South America. It's in an the Antarctic. Are, are you saying that doesn't exist? Are you saying the tip of South America is in the Antarctic? No, I'm saying that Past the tip of uh, South America, there's another that that branch of the Antarctic. You can call it a ring, whatever you want to call it. That it's right there. There's an airport. Antarctic Peninsula. Yeah, that's yes. above the circle, though. That's part of the Antarctica is above the circle. Okay, so that's you guys fine. have a video showing 24-hour sun from that location. No, because you can't get it from that location. It's outside. The Antarctic Circle. Uh, but here's the thing. If okay, does does that all the all the flat plane horizontal people? Do y'all, y'all, who is emptying their pockets and doing coke? coke? Apparently, somebody. <laughs> At the same time, it's got to be really good. <laughs> Pocket coke. All right. Um, in the summertime, the the sun stays out longer, right? Yeah. Everybody agrees with that. It doesn't matter if it's summer in the north or summer in the south, correct? Yeah. Okay. So can uh, any any point in the southern hemisphere, the the closest to the to the ice wall as you can get, right? They still experience. Longer days than than uh, during their winter time, right? What's that? At the extremities of the southern latitudes that we we have humans, they experience longer summers or longer daylight during the summertime as opposed to their winter. Is that correct? You'd expect so. Okay, can you explain how that works on a flat Earth? The sun is more south so you'd expect that they'd have longer days it's summer in the southern you know area southern hemisplane if you will i want you to think that from a purely okay so at sun at sunrise the sun is at its furthest point away from from wherever point that is that experiences sunrise in the south right repeat that what what the fuck did you just say it's not complicated you're, you're speaking at sunrise, gibberish. no, I'm not. At sunrise, the sun is the furthest away it can be from what whichever point in the south that is experiencing that sunrise. Is this correct? More gibberish. No, nope. too it's complicated for them. Simple geometry. It's just, it's just yeah. gibberish. See how they think it's gibberish? It's it's too high level thinking for them. Okay. All we need Jeremy, to do is find the speed. The, All we need to do is find the speed. I didn't. Have, I just said nothing about. All we need to do is find the speed. I said nothing about speed. I know. All I'm telling you what the real argument should be for you guys. The real argument for you guys should be. If the yeah, speed you don't get the to sub dictate the argument, dude. But you were wrong so about that thing that you said at sunrise. That's wrong. It would be how is that at wrong? midnight. I want you to explain to me how that's at wrong. The, at the peak of night. The sun would be farthest away, halfway between sunrise and sunset. I said at sunset. It's the furthest away at sunset. No, it would be midnight. Would be the furthest away. During the day, uh, do I have to? Do I have to walk this that? Oh, far during now? the day, then it would be do sunrise and sunset equally. What was that? Well, it depends. It, no, it depends on if you're at one of those black swan moment sunrises where you can see 
uh, much farther. And then, and then you're seeing, you know, it depends, thing, it, this this all depends on the atmosphere. Yeah, it would depend on refraction. This it would depend on atmospheric, on atmospheric effect. <laughs> okay, yeah. so you're not really... Atmospheric effect, but in general, the, you know, it would be more or less you're gonna the make same. The sun, which should be to your north from the south pole in, your, in the pizza model behind you to the south. Refraction is going to pull the sun 180 degrees around you? What? They don't even oh, understand this percentage, argument. Percentage. I Good swear, luck. like, they all gibberish. All over the place. Jeremy, it's not all gibberish. Black. The sun, at sunset and sunrise, the sun will be more or less as far away. How far away? Who knows? There's Very not a who though. knows. Hold on. Percentage said something correct. There's a momentous occasion. Yeah, it's momentous occasion. Curved admitted to it. The differential in time you're going to get from refraction at sunrise and sunset is pretty minuscule in the big picture, Jeremy. Quit trying to major in the minors, you evasive prick. Um, Kerb basically just called Listen, you a basic don't bitch. Be mad are you going to take that, Branch Jeremy? had you all fired up earlier. It's not my fault. Jeremy, are you going to sit there and take that? Fuck off, Nidhug. <laughs> all right, first of all, Jeremy, I'm mad at you because you. Get that part straight. I'm always mad. Yeah. you like Because you guys practice. are always you. Don't that get mad. True. Get even. Kerb is mad all the time, but you guys make me mad too, so. We could be having a nice breakfast with eggs, bacon, and, to and Kerb will still be mad over it. While lying like about man, something. Screaming in your ear. You just try to enjoy man. some nice sunny side up. Shit. And if I was there, I'd punch you in the throat. Have to keep I wouldn't punch right? you in the throat. Right. I wouldn't right. be around you. Uh, I'd punch him. All right, so what's the, what's the point there. that's being uh, deflected from here with sunrise, sunset? Somebody's trying to make a point. <laughs> Tell There's no what point, the really. There's no point. There's really no, there point. is no uh, 24 hours. There's just a lot of claims about thrown around. South. That's what we're looking for. Nate, you got any people in the tropics that are willing to do some stuff for no money? No, Jeremy. I, you, you already asked me, and I told you. Like, <laughs> my people wouldn't talk to me if I told them I'm trying to do flat Earth experiments. Yeah, you got to bring it back to you, Jeremy. Oh, oh yeah. Go ahead, Kerb. Kerb. Actually, the point being made was that um, there's double standards when it comes to what is accepted as evidence, because they apparently accept evidence of 24-hour suns in the North Pole, but they won't accept evidence for 24-hour suns in the South Pole. It's incorrect to say that, Nate. We well, all know exactly... why. No, there's yeah. no double standard in evidence um, yes, accepted. Yes, there is. It's because... 24-hour sun in the North no, is isn't. not a problem for your model based... So, yeah, that's not because we have a bias in accepting that, away. that evidence. You can't do it it's in because the South. It's never Therefore, been contended. It's all not efforts contended. are made to deny that it occurs in the South. It's that simple. That's Listen, so it. when a claim is rejected and evidence is asked for, there's no double standard in the threshold of evidence. They want, you know, verifiable, definitive evidence for that claim. Now, whether or not they okay, contend the claim in the first place is what matters. And so for the North, a lot here's of flat earthers, some do, you, then, a lot of flat earthers don't even contend the claim. All right, so percent. The standards of evidence are the same, though. They look sem in Tierra de Fuego. They have an enormous amount of light dur uh, during the portion where the sun is at the furthest south. However, for a large portion of that, they are looking south for something that should be in the opposite fucking direction. Explain that. That's the model, not reality. Oh, like again, someone's in that. trouble. Who in, in Tierra de Fuego. de Fuego is looking south at the sun? Is that what Brian said? What do you mean, looking south? Talk to him, Curved. That's Brian just throwing yeah, there, not thinking before he speaks. Night. Brian, you want to explain? I just, yourself? I just need a simple clarification on what do you mean by looking south? Can we put some numbers to it, Azimuth? Brian, he's talking to you. Looking south. Yeah, which way is south on a flat Earth? Brian's ran away. I that way. away. Oh, that north. way. You sure it's that way or not that way? Yeah, it's opposite of north. So, 
the direction that they're looking at the sun is not the direction it would have to be on a flat Earth. Where is this place? Yeah, you're talking Sierra south of me, south of west. Fine. Where is that? Up your butt. Is Tierra del Fuego Argentina or Chile? Regardless, it's the very southern tip of South America. No, oh, just Ar Ushuaia. I think he's Argentinian. Land of fire. Shout out to Curb. England. Yeah, so, I mean, there's no evidence for... Um, well, you don't uh, even have to go that far. You can still just go to fucking... Uh, so you can still go to Australia during uh, when the sun is the furthest south. Their sun rises south of east. It should be fucking 30 degrees northwest of them. I'm sorry, 30 degrees northeast of them. According to the fucking model, uh, flat models. There's no way to make that work without invoking absolute stupidity. There is no flat earth model. There is nothing no works and nothing there's has no to work. There's no model, there's no flat model. They're both free of... It's like the ultimate pinnacle of, of scientific excellence. Alright, so let's have a look at the global model. Completely models. useless, guys. No Just prediction. substantiate the claims you make. Exactly. Show we did, in the same way that you substantiated the 24-hour sun in the north. We did. The same way you accept evidence in the, in the north. Show Video. with, like, you know, definitive evidence. You know, There's nothing definitive. 24 hour sun you, can always come, you can always come up with something that doesn't make sense to you, which means it no longer is definitive. Your subjective Don't worry about me. Don't worry about my thresh threshold. Absolutely Just do it in an effort to have integrity and be intellectually honest. Substantiate your claim. It's been substantiated to a reasonable expectation. I'm, it's unfortunate that you're unreasonable. If you say so. And you no, don't want to hear that your intellectual your dishonesty. What you're doing right now is the most dishonest thing. First off, I said Where intellectually you honest, declare not dishonest. Something. Yeah, but you're, you're Secondly, not being intellectually no honest. Point. You're being dishonest. Asking people to substantiate their claims is not being dishonest. So you have no point. It has been substantiated to the same standard that you use. Okay, keep lying. It's not our responsibility for you not accepting the evidence. You can't resolve your contradiction. How you accept you that evidence? Here, let's give another home. example. Here, let's 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 try another. Let's try another one. What altitude do planes fly at, and how do you know this? I'm not contesting it. So why would I even, you know, I'm not play because game. I want to know your standard of evidence. Well, I I don't worry about an example it. to define your standard. Don't worry about it. I'm not contesting okay, fine. that. Okay, I don't have to worry about your standard. Not a wild then it stands. Yeah, right, yeah, right, 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 right. Sounds like you're sweating about it. Okay, so then it stands that the, the 24 hour sun in the south has been proven. Just and you can you just say, say no, but so. that for doesn't you, make it true. Not for me. If you say mm -hmm. so. Yes, for yeah. you. For me, as well. it's, there's a lack of definitive evidence. They haven't shown. Only know, because of your double standard. Only in the south. They haven't shown that it's verifiably in the south. That's not it's a double always standard. Been we have millions of eyewitness accounts. We have millions of eyewitness accounts of the north, thousands of videos. And in the south, we got two videos we've debunked. And a few people that say it happened. So the standard of evidence is not the same for the southern and the northern 24 hour sun, bitch. Exactly. Sorry, Citation sir. needed. Damn. <laughs> Damn, Jeremy. Citation like for I said, you. Always been shown, but it's always dismissed and never. My man it only takes one video, Jeremy. That's the black swan idea that you guys use. It only takes one. You're done. What we do just got some small debunked. penis energy, man. Are you resorting to ad hom because you've been cornered? No, it's just it, it's your vibe that like you're giving it. off is yeah. that you're like, you know, you're projecting so you want to respond you, you to the topic or you just want to something. You want to just you want to respond to the topic or you want to remain Okay, what's well, I'm topic. responding to the topic. Yeah, I said that's... I want verifiable evidence that it's in the south. How do we know it's in the south? Yes. The same way that you watched the video. Was taken in the north. The video. But the if way I'm we know it's in the north, me. as Jeremy just said, there was thousands of video, hundreds and thousands of eyewitnesses, and in the Millions. south, Millions. in the south, you've only got two probably hundred of millions throughout history. Not yeah, you've got Maybe only two in the south, and a couple of liars who think they've been there and seen it. That's not definitive. Show me, show me a hundred videos that are to the standard that you require with no cuts. No speed, time lapse, or anything like that. I want to see a, a type in. Like that now you're being intellectually dishonest, Mike, because YouTube. you do not contest. No, he's not. You do not contest. Type in www.youtube.com. What he's doing.
And twenty. What he's and, doing is holding you to your same standard of evidence. No, I'm giving you a website where you can see all these videos, Mark, on www.youtube.com. I did. Did you look at them? Did you look at them? Did you look at the ones I gave you, Fuckstain? There are thousands of videos in the north on www.youtube.com. Really? Yes. Yes, w, our Vimeo has uh, at least, uh, let's see, 10 videos from one guy. Then there's another uh, couple dozen of them on uh, uh, YouTube. And uh, based on the number of people who go down there, I don't find that that unreasonable. You've got a handful of videos, a handful That's of a people <laughs> keeping the lie going. But they're better produced. The ones in the South are better produced. No, the funny people. thing is that even if we looked at one of these, you guys wouldn't know if it's in the North or the South. You would just look at the title and say, okay, yep, it's in the North. But you wouldn't be able to tell. We've, we've already, to we've already debunked. The you we've can tell already the buildings debunked. that are down there, the Antarctic stations that are down there. Yeah, we've we can tell, debunked. but these guys can't. We've we didn't debunk them, them, Jeremy. You denied them. There's a huge difference. No, we didn't debunk shit, thoroughly, Jeremy. Shut up. We thoroughly no, debunked there are landmarks? of the... Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah you didn't debunk shit. Oh, my God. I, they yeah, won't let me talk, Kimo. They're funny muting me, Kimo. They do it a Google all. video oh search of 24 stun in the South Pole brings back 316,000 results. And what about the North? Oh, fuck. What about it? It was double that. So 316 is not enough? No. No, no. We need 3,000. Go through those video. Go through those videos and see how many of them are actually in the south and some are in the north. Because when I search for the twenty-four hour northern sun, I get twenty-four hour southern sun. So clearly, you're not just getting. Have you been clearly through them? Ju- clearly, you're not just getting twenty-four hour uh, southern sun. Yeah, have you been through them Jeremy, as well? How do you, you know those videos were in the north? Yeah, I went 000? through. Them. I went through them. Was three hundred sixteen thousand videos you went through? I went through the first few of this. Like. Look at how much trouble you guys are having fulfilling one basic criterion, which is to yeah, ensure that it's in the retarded. south. Exactly. That's the, just the first most basic the criterion, most... and you guys are just having so much trouble, just fucking fumbling with. No, it. Yeah, it was no, we did that with ease. Yeah, you, and you couldn't ease? explain yeah. the lunar eclipse at all. So that's a good one for know, Flat Earth. Tell us about we've lunar got eclipse. We've, 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 we've got a. We've got a. We've got a glaring hole in your theory unless you plug it with something. Now, if you're going to go flat Zoid's path and say that it was the same way it works on a globe, he rarely stepped in at that time uh, and subsequently has left the chat. So, yeah, lunar eclipses, sunsets, sunrise, all of these things kill the flat Earth. Dead. Well, uh, how do they work on a globe? Wishful What's... thinking. How do they work on your model? Just dead. Can you explain how they work on your model? Yeah, I think it could be fair. Quite, no, wait. It yeah. But it could be fair if Kimo explained it on the globe. You've been here for so many years. You should be able to, to explain to us so we know you really understand. That's what I'm asking for, an explanation of how it works on the globe. Yeah, it spurs, it's a globe, and it works. That's how it works. How does it work? What causes... Kimo, you know... Kimo, you That's know. how it works. It's a globe. How easy is that? Kimo, you yeah, know... Sure. Kimo, well, you, are, you are aware of the explanations, and now you are pretending as you are... You don't like your own it. arguments thrown back at you, do you? No, I'm about to answer. You're saying the answer for the eclipse is it's a globe. That's what you say no. about flat. That's what your answer is to explain the yeah, eclipse. Yes, it's, it's a, a globe. globe. Yes. Just to shout out, it's a globe, just because. No, this okay, how does it work? How, how, does it, how does it feel, Spurs? How does it feel? Well, that's to have your point. own penis put up your own ass. You're just saying it's a globe, and that's how we know how the eclipses work. Can I answer yeah, yes. that? Feel? No. How does it feel? How does it feel? Well, what kind that of was answer? Was what, answer. What kind of answer is that, that- was? That was was exactly the right, Spurs. The correct one. What the kind correct of answer one. is that, Spurs? That's exactly my point. Exactly. How's so, it feel? Yeah. Let's ask somebody else. Was what is the reason for <laughs> you the don't eclipse? get it, <laughs> man, man, Kimo? You're so, you're really out 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 of this world. So everybody have been explaining to you during last month, I think, for three times how the eclipse is working, and you're still asking after. One month, how the eclipse is working, and, and you need somebody to explain it again for you. You're yeah. stupid, man. I'm asking you, what's the cause? No, man, 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 man. Shut up. 
I'm asking who do you, you think is going to explain it to you? Who do you think is going to explain it to you for the fourth time in this month how the eclipse is working? Well, that's what I'm asking you. What is the cause? No, for no, I'm not going to. I'm not going to respond to you. You have the you have the answer in the past for the three times. And what was that you're, answer? You, you, you don't you don't times. have not even. Do you remember what you said? Not four times. I would say eight times. Do you remember it's, what you said, Dakotas? Man, man, it's hilarious, man. Stop, stop doing stupid things on, on on the Discord. Why are you afraid to give the answer again? Because it has been explained to you. So what was the explanation for eclipses? What's the point in giving it to you again? Well, what so the... you can ask again Because later. he might have forgotten the answer. I'll give it to you again, Spurs. It works on the globe because You've it's a globe. You've already said a globe. There you go. You said globe because it's a globe. That's your answer. I want to hear. There from you the... go. How does it feel? Yeah. I want to hear from Decodus what the reason. How does it is feel, Spurs? Eclipse. How does it feel? So you don't have an answer. Get it into you, mate. Get it into you. How does it feel? <laughs> you must quite comfortable. So the, there is no answer. Isn't that a beer? I bet, I bet it didn't touch the sides, did it? I bet it Isn't didn't touch your sides. Isn't that a beer red watch? How do you feel? Real quick do you like question, it? Bro. How does it feel? So, Dakotas, you don't have an answer for the cause of this eclipse. No, don't need one, mate. How does it happen? Dakotas, just tell him you don't need one and ask him how it feels. I don't have to give him an answer because I know he's you don't. Be retarded. He's going to be retarded to understand it. So, why do I have to bother? So I'm just the making sure the audience. Is his own answer. I'm making sure Thank the audience you, are aware that these globers are scared. Hey, running, you missed, running scared. Hey, you missed out on an opportunity there. That there is fear amongst the Globertha camp. And oh, I'm shaking what? my boots. What was? What? The coders are afraid to say the cause of this. He missed out on an opportunity there for an answer, but he didn't do it. Uh, Again, what? that trick never works. Okay, yeah, so it was you're preventing calm other people down, from answering down, this question. It's time for chemo's evening, sir. I'll prevent what needs to be prevented. Space. Yeah, you're preventing um, the truth from coming out. Was why are you wasted Am I? today? Am I? Are you wasted? <laughs> okay, please answer then, chemo. How does it work on a flat Earth? No, I'm asking what's the cause of this eclipse. Where's your truth, Spurs? Where's your truth? It doesn't, it Where's doesn't your matter. Truth? It works because it's a flat Earth, right? So I is hope everyone is listening that they're now afraid. It to works give on the a flat Earth because it's a flat Earth. Of what causes is that your truth? The eclipse. That wasn't. Go on. That's not how this works. I asked you first, and then you're trying you're to a answer a big question with a right, question. Guys, guys, seriously, can, can we? Can we? So you're right, Brent. Jeremy and Spicen have got awfully Please. quiet. Oh, well, we're I'm just trying to get an answer of what Who's causes oh, the eclipse. People, order in the house. Awfully quiet. The right. heliocentric model causes well, what's the your eclipse. Point, chemo? Take your point, chemo. Take okay, so point. what we're doing, Branch, we're looking for a globe earther who can present a reason of why the eclipses happen. Okay. Mm -hmm. What's the cause of it? Do I need to even ask? I don't know. The Do you know anybody who knows? Do you know anybody Spurs, who knows? if you want us to fight your stupidity. Bullshit, bro. If yeah, you want us chemo, to fight you... Chemo, make a better point. Was I think you should fight this alcoholism. But look, what we're looking for is a It's cause. not an ism, mate. It's just a few drinks. Yeah, you need to start no, fighting chemo, that. No, the one. fact is... What we need to look at is the cause of you know why the point, eclipse chemo. happens in the first place. Does anybody have an answer of why and how the eclipses work? Yes, I do. I have a really? great answer. Do you? I'm, I'm just posting the answer. We have no answer. idea how the oh, sky what? works. Does anybody else, else have go. an idea of how hey, the sky yeah, works? Hey. There's, your, hey. there's your extra evidence to help you, Was. I know how I know how eclipse works. Thanks, Ray. You can't verify how the sky works, Chemo. It's a fruitless endeavor. I mean, it's like so that. No, no, that there, are, there are just about 50 globe heads. Sun and moon. Maybe around 40 Sun globe moon. heads. Now, one of those globe heads must know what causes the eclipse and how it works. Right, but the I, definition. I well, definition branch has got it. Branch, 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 right, branch. Branch, you're over talking, to, uh, Terry. Branch, branch, go ahead. No, hang on. Branch has got an explanation. Go ahead, branch. Oh, has he? Okay, go on, Brent. I'm just trying to say the Make definition of an, ex of an eclipse. Mm -hmm. how, how it works. Mm hmm. 
purely when you talk about an eclipse yeah the definition of what an eclipse is mm-hmm. tells you how it works already okay so what 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 kind of questions are you asking chemo about the definition what's the definition of an eclipse okay, well the, the definition of an eclipse is something being in front of something right? mm. Okay. Causing a shadow. Okay, so what? That's an eclipse. Fine, what's causing that shadow? That's the definition. And the the whole point of why we came up with this notion of eclipses Mm -hmm. because how we describe Mm -hmm. not just um, the sun and the moon, but you know, we we can describe like planets eclipsing other planets and shit like that, right? It's just, it's just something you, uh, that you translate was what he's saying. Yeah, mate, he's saying we live on a model, mate. Mm-hmm. We make the model from our observations. Mm-hmm. That's how the model's derived. It's, mm-hmm. it's a model of reality, and that's what we live on. Truth, Rig, can you translate what was was just saying? You're sober. You don't understand. Oh my well, God, you're a bit you gone know. with the wind, was right. you know? Let me translate it for you. Don't you understand what I said, Spurs? Struth. Have you been drinking? Struth. What have no. you been drinking, Spurs? Are you drunk? Slur- you're slurring a bit. Yeah, you, 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 you. Oh, good for sake, was. Come on. Let me, let me explain. How did we get a full sentence out? Hello, hold, hold on. Let's let Rig. Struth. Let Rig. What is he saying, mate? What's going on? Was. Just fuck it. Just let Rig do it. Let's see what happens. What did he say? Was. What's he saying? Are you talking to me or Rig? No, I'm asking Riggs you what Brant says Riggs to translate like the drunken who's talk who's for me. Who's your second best choice? Riggs, Riggs not, not here, Spurs. Brant, you're saying Riggs not here, Spurs. That's oh. what Brant is saying. Oh, yeah, true. There's Merle. Come here. on, Spurs. What have you been Shalani drinking, Spurs? Here, Can't you even see that? Oh, truth. Where's Merle? Drunk? What are you even saying, boss? Let me uh, let me get Merle to translate for you. You have to get it. Maybe Terry can help you. Ah, Terry. Terry what yes, am I sorry, saying? Yes, Terry. Terry's Will, sober. Will, yes, Will absolutely. Might be a great I was looking for an Aussie. Hang <laughs> hey, on, Branch. Will, Terry Will might Will be able to explain what, what I'm saying, saying to Terry? Spurs that Spurs doesn't understand. What is he saying, Terry? What, what doesn't what doesn't um, Spurs understand? Everything that we, live, oh, that we live on, a, we live so, on the globe. So Terry, you're, you're yeah, translating. Terry, hold you're translating what uh, was on, said. Branch. That what um, I thought Branch said. We Hang on, Branch. Players. The Branch said something to was. Was said something to me, but was is hard to understand. So we need an Australian Terry to translate what he's saying. I, I just heard over talking too much. <laughs> oh, oh. But we live on a globe. What else do you need to know about that? Uh, how do we know we live on a globe? Because of the sunrise and sunset, star trails. Uh, I'm going to keep going. No, no, you can start with that sunset, sunrise. How does that prove a globe? England. This could all be so simple, Terry, but you'd rather make it Oh, hard. Spears. Come on, Spears. What's he saying, Tessa? Do you need another drink, Spears? What, what's this? Would you need a fuck a drink, mate? <laughs> Look, was okay. What we're yeah, trying well, you to want, do... it's your shout, Spurs. Come on, mate. Yeah, I'll have one. I'm not trying to upset you, but look, we're trying to figure out uh, the shape of the earth. Okay? You never figure anything out, mate. Well, we're trying to. We're mm-hmm. trying. We're triers. Okay? You're very you trying. S- you can't say that we didn't try at least. Yes. Oh, we can say. We can say that clearly. At least we and tried. with full confidence that you have not tried. We've tried to look at your evidence, no, and you uh, it fell short. You're close-minded. Look how close your mind is. Well, we're looking at uh, Cavendish. You're understanding me now, right? The fact uh, that we look now at you Cavendish. Me. Now you don't need a translator. What's going on now? I had a bit of a, I had a bit to drink. Hmm. Mm. That's right. So we're on the same <laughs> level now, aren't we? No, was we're not. <laughs> You're way down there, still trying to catch up. With the science, the knowledge, the facts. The <laughs> right out of there. Okay. Catch me up, mate. Come on, catch me up. Okay, so look, again, uh, I know you're trying to distract. It's, it is humorous, but at the end of the day, you've been lied Of course to. it's humorous. Look, at the end of the day, the earth's not flat. And anyone that thinks it is, you've got to have a bit of fun with them, right? Um, well, I mean... You, you have to. I mean, what else can you do with these people? They, they obviously and cleanly think that there's a worldwide conspiracy that's been going on for decades and generations. Mm-hmm. I mean, anyone that thinks like that, you've got to have some fun with them. 
I mean, you're not going to change their mind. What's the point trying? Well, I mean, these was, people come in here. Thing. These people come in here and tell you how this works and that works. They give you the maths. They give you the angles. It's pointless. It's like throwing shit against a brick wall. <laughs> it's going to get you nowhere. Well, so why not have fun not even, with it? It's, it's not even as pointless, right? It's ludicrous. The, the well, no, no. To be fair, there are, there are the few people that come in here honestly looking uh, for how things work. And and you got to give them some time. Right, but That's fair. The pe- the but there are people. That, the people hang on, branch. Hang on, branch. Was. Hang on, branch. Hang on, branch. There are people that come in here and don't want to know. They've got it set in their head. So why not have some fun with them? Like Spurs here, for example. Exactly. Now I've always said was the right. Transition- so don't take him seriously because oh he'll just make you mad. I I take I take Spurs very seriously. Well, he's going to make you mad. He- I wouldn't too late. Take it. I look, wouldn't take look, it seriously. Well, what you guys don't understand is this: Spurs. Every time he he like you know mutes me, which I'm going to do in a minute. If you don't let us continue, and it's cool. It's not nice. I don't. I don't like it when Spurs tickles my penis. I feel. I feel like Branch. Like he's talking porn. You zip no, it up, I'm Branch. Not my porn. Yeah, you zip it up, Spurs doesn't like stop, that kind of stop, talk. Stop it. Stop it. Please stop it. Keep it clean. Yeah, I'm not talking about that. What I'm Keep saying is clean that, too. please stop abusing me. Especially if you're not circumcised. You are abusing Branch. <laughs> Branch, don't because, make it about um, you, Branch. What's happening is that you're um, disrupting the class, as it were. Okay, we're trying we to... all come here for the abuse. Well, some do. So, yeah. so bo- bottom bottom line is, Spurs, you've actually got n- nothing really. You've got a lot of words. I'll give you that. Plenty mm-hmm. of words, but when it comes down to the nitty gritty, you you haven't got anything. Oh uh, yeah. Oh. Even Brian Mabbitt needs to get in here. He's asking for an unmute. Yeah, yeah, I've done it. I don't know why you guys um, are so aggressive to the truth. Oh, you know, you know what, you know what Brian's like. He's he's the type of guy that you want to have fun with, but he won't allow it. Well, he can't get a word in sideways. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> hey, Brian. Brian doesn't know how to uh, have fun. Oh, uh, you know, he he just muted and deafened himself. I get that you guys want to have fun. Um, yeah, that's what's what. Well, no, we're having a serious conversation. It doesn't. We're having serious fun, to... Spurs. The globe yes. is a fantasy, so you have fun with your stories, which is fine. It's not a problem. But there is a time, obviously, where there you we... go. There you go, Spurs. That's the way. That's now you're I'm doing it. About. That's Keep exactly. it up. That's Keep it up. A bit more of that, mate. But what happens just... was when we bring uh, the reality and stop the stories. Um, people do get upset. There you go. Now you now you got the hang of it. Well, I understand. You know, that, that's people... that's what I that's how I see serious fun, mate. You're bringing it now. So we do need people like yourself to bring that light, uh, humorous side to it because this is devastating. You know. Well, it's serious humor. You understand that, right? Yeah, it's serious humor. Uh, it's any anything to transition from globe to flat. Anything because the hu- the humor the humor is inside of itself. If you know what I'm saying, you know the humor is inside the argument itself. Is that the same as the science uh, inside the heliocentric model? Uh, you can draw that as an analogy. Yeah. To okay. describe to describe uh, the humor that's in FE. Yes, you can do that. <laughs> yes. That's a good you got analogy. it right. See, see that yeah. Yeah, that made you have a giggle. Is that like a plumb bob that is perpendicular inside itself? Yeah, it's like how do you know a plumb bob's a plumb bob's vertical? Was because it's vertical what, what time onto is it? itself. What time is it? Was that Where is you classic. What time is it? Uh, two thirty-five. Two thirty-five a.m. In the morning, yeah. In the a.m. Yeah. Yeah, in the morning was. What's yeah, up? in the a.m. Yeah, two thirty-five. Everything all right? You're keeping me up, Spurs. Is everything is everything all right? Yeah, I'm fine. How you about you? Me? No. You How can everything be all right when we've been lied to about the shape of the Earth? What's wrong with you? Oh, Spurs. Is everything all right? You, there you go again, getting yourself caught up with this thing. 
Think about it. They've lied to our young people. I've, th- I've thought about it. No, seriously, I have thought about that. Young about people that. have no chance I, I have to, thought, uh, I've thought to defend I themselves think about against this. this lied. No, my, my, my brother-in-law and I used to discuss this a lot when we were in our, our early 30s. Uh, late twenties, mm. and so you know, I thought about it a lot, Spurs. And the older I got, the more I realised that yeah, it's not, it's not, a, it's not a conspiracy. It seems just, to be getting a lot it's just unsustainable. It seems to be getting harder for you guys to swallow. The pill seems to be getting a lot bigger and bigger. Huh? Well, what's hard to swallow? It's like you got it stuck sorry, in your throat and it grows. What's hard to swallow? Just more... The more you excite the pill, the bigger it will get. That's true. So my, my, my right. advice yeah, to you is to stop tickling it. About, oh, fuck. Brent. What I want, I want you to tell me what you're talking about, Kimo. Still just say that um, <clears throat> for the global. He doesn't want to. Um, you can't he doesn't even tell it. me, can you? He's practicing safe you sex, it, you know Brent. Bullshit. You, can't even, you can't even tell me what you said. Mm-hmm. What's up with that, Kimo? Um, I don't think there's much to tell, really, apart from we've been lied to. I mean, correct. There's nothing much to it's tell. Not a big of a deal. Uh, apart from why, if you want to know why not. they would lie, then I suppose that's the big deal. But apart from that, it's just been lied to. Get your head over it. Get around it. Just move on. Have a nice day. Don't get hung up on the lie. See? No, but I do get hung up on the lie, bro. Because you know why. Hmm. Life fucks with me, man. Life is a pretty dark, um, you know, dark place, sinister place, where you, you know you um, are right. a target for the elite in one way or another. Yeah, you are set for right. elimination. <coughs> like, like nice to me. Right, like uh, if you if you consider like someone like let's uh, say DMX, I am... yeah. like DMX, oh right? curved. Curved asked about DMX. Why didn't Zachary so, Hall predict it? And wait, he did. Five oh. days before. Let me get it up. I couldn't believe it. I was going to show it last night. So Zachary wait, Hubbard wait, predicted on, DMX's very... death a oh, week before I'm sorry, I'm sorry. it even Ke- happened chemo, through the chemo, numbers. Chemo, 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 real quick. Mm-hmm. Calm down. You seem very excited right now. So just remember. Calm, so just remind me of something. Calm it down, Chemo. Calm it down. Right? Mm-hmm. Are you calm chemo but he already called it out um we, uh, okay, week ago. he gave DMX us last week's now. news what was it about dmx oh, that don't you say so like uh, i did chemo. they've taken it down don't say that already oh um, they did let me check yeah they killed him why did no, he? I mean, like, oh you know, no way! Like, it was, it was like, okay, guys, guys, I think you guys need to stop, drop. Why did his prediction come out after his death, chemo? No, no, it was on the. It was um a week ago. Sure, what was? What day? What day did he do it? I'm trying to find. I knew I should. Did have you see it, it a week night. ago? Did you see it a week ago, chemo? No. Instead. Or did you see something after the fact that was edited to uh, give you the impression it was predicted before it? Well, they've taken it down. And it, oh, no. What's this one? Yeah. Mindless sheep. Hey, Kimo, why would we ask hey, you hey, for Kimo, flat earth Kimo, evidence? Okay. Do you constantly Kimo, withhold Kimo, I can't believe this. It's okay. flat earth evidence? It's very okay. Oh, Kimo, I've done look, a little bit DMX of said, research. It took me a DMX couple minutes. Said, I've been look, waiting look, forever to get it in, Kimo. DMX, why do you withhold this DMX letter of was, evidence? DMX was one of the first motherfuckers to coin this in a rap, right? He was like, you know, if you love something, let it go. He also said, you think this is a game? You think, <laughs> you think Globe Earth is a game? <laughs> Globe abortion. So, Kimo. Bro, I, Going I back to the sunrise like, sunset like, thing in the southern hemisphere, I looked up sunrise yeah, yeah, yeah. on December twenty first when the sun's down like near over Tropic of Capricorn in Sydney, Australia. Ah, oh, found it. I found it. This was six days ago. Degrees. 
Like unless yeah, YouTube, yeah, well, that's old news now. No, old unless news. unless YouTube you have changed Why? the date. Did you not hear me talking, Kimo? No, you asked for the video. Or did you not that. even look before you right. merged on so the is. freeway? It is a blood sacrifice. Six days uh, on the yeah, third. Yeah, and you were silent, and I was talking. So I was looking for the video. And then you, I don't care. You can wait till I'm done to come up with this bullshit that you've looked up and finally found, which yeah. is going to be bullshit. It's there anyway. So again, 3rd of April. The azimuth to sunrise from Sydney. Sydney is 119 degrees. From Ushuaia down in Tierra del Fuego. Well, the azimuth to sunrise is 135 degrees. 16 degrees farther south, farther east of north. That's how azimuth works, east of north. 16 degrees farther south of east. When you're 21 degrees further south on the earth, you're looking even farther south to the sunrise. Now, how the fuck does that work? Globe side or flat earth side? Who's got a clue? Lock, lock them down shot side. Lemon could model that. Lemon's not here at the moment. Lemon could not model. He couldn't even model something out of fucking Play-Doh. Lemon can't model jack shit. Hey, I could, I could, I could he can just use word salad could, to make you think hey, that he's a smart person, but he's really not. So the answer to the question is what? Very nice guy. What is the answer to the question? You know, no, God, Lemon is not I, I a nice guy. Is this a globe? Do it. Is this a flat earth? Which one fits this observation? Well, again, I say Lemon will be able to model this if you want to uh, work with the numbers. Well, if yeah, you want to see a model. On lemon. So you just listen to what these retards tell you, Kimo? You can't think about this and work it out for yourself? Uh, if you want to see a model, I don't really care Jose, to Joe's Lays did an excellent one from McMurrow. On How the don't this work on a flat earth? Why in the hell would this happen on a you globe? Want model, watch fashion Do TV. either one of them make sense? Look, I don't build models, Kurt. What's wrong with you? Don't build a model. Answer the question. Yeah, you need a model, obviously, right? Which one does does it make sense on it either? And why? And yeah, Lemon is the man to figure out your model. He's the closest model okay. that we can. Just say white black, chemo. Say white black. Say chemo is a retard. Chemo don't know. Chemo have no model. Chemo don't reification, VFI model. No. Don't worry about a model. I don't think, I don't think you understand what the reification is. would work on a flat Earth or a globe, if either one, and why. Right, wait till Lemon shows up. Stop asking about a model. We deal with practical Pussy. things. We deal with uh, blue. When, when, uh, when I think about the reification fallacy, I think about Zoo... Yeah, when I when I think about the reification out. fallacy, I think about Zoolander Again, when, they, when he shows him the to you about a model. Cool. I'll be done in a minute. And he says this needs to be. I I, I had no question about a model chemo. I just asked you whether this would work on a flat Earth or a globe, if either one, and why. Oh, and you works. have no answer. You have plane. nothing, chemo. You have, we're on a flat plane. It works. What Your rhetoric plane? is impotent, chemo. No question about a model. Just, just like wonder you. if this will work on a flat Earth or globe Earth model. Right. Exactly. You don't even have to model it. Dude, just get the model out of your head. Get some practical measurement. Then you'll have your answers. No model in my head. I've got data, observations, measurements, and asking which one fits reality. Hmm. Would this work Kimo on a globe? Also thinks Sammy Sosa Would this was, work uh, on a flat Earth? Earth? How? You Kurt, can't answer. What does Kimo have, though? So what don't, don't respond. Have? Don't give me this model bullshit. No more of your nonsense, Kimo. Move on to the next topic. Since you have nothing for this, you impotent cuck. Yeah, I mean, again, anyone not, who answers this... Not all cucks are impotent. Uh, Fuck up, Kimo. Move on. A ray of, a ray of trouble here. Break right down the straw man model, which we don't have. It's not hard to defeat a flat earth model because it's not real. Now, measurements, you can't show that there is a drop practically uh, on the horizontal. In the real sure, physical world, 
in the real physical world practically yeah, somebody wants to sound but the real so physical true. world is yeah. flat it until is proven otherwise real. exactly so um and when i think about the reification fallacy i was trying to point out that it reminds me of that zoolander uh part where he says this 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 model need this building needs to be at least three times the size what is this a school for ants that's the reification fallacy Nobody claims that a model is real in uh, in a physical sense, which is what reification is, chemo. When we have a description of something, that is not reification. You do not have yes, a description. That's what I'm saying, because, because Zoolander thought that the model that they had created for the school for kids who can't read good, um, he was treating that like the real school. He thought that was a real school, and he had a problem with that. And that was because he was committing what was called the reification fallacy. What are you want about? Uh, says, what is this? About... A school for ants? Right, Stacks right for once. No, no, this is a model, a reification model. This is a fallacy. Yes, something different. No, it's not a reification because it's not concrete in reality. The number saying it is. Stop if that I feel right like now. A... A model oh, car that was like crazy, one to five yeah, scale, like, or like I don't know, one to twenty scale, and you like said you that's not that's not even real because people can't fit in there. That's way too small for people to get into. It's just that's eating. how we know that this is thing. real. Was just as eating then? Sounded like he was eating. <laughs> Who's whistling? Fuck off. Oh, that that's really one of the most annoying things you can do. Don't whistle on the microphone. I think e Dude, I did annoying. not realize I was unmuted. And I <laughs> yeah, okay. You just yeah. leaned into your microphone and whistled. You're right. You didn't realize that you weren't muted, though. So, Kima, have you now learned what a reification fallacy is and why having a model isn't reification? I've got a mouthful. We're not clear on that. Right. We're right, right now. Who, who, who muted me for that? Eating on mic, asking questions, going bleh, 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 chemo, bleh, bleh, bleh. chemo, chemo. Yes. What am I eating? Not you, foolish. Dress is eating on mic. That's yeah, yeah. Eating on mic, dress. Everyone could hear you. So let's not um, eat. Hi. Okay, Mo, when did you hear me eat? Because I'm not eating at the moment. That's very, very funny that you make that accusation. So again, are you clear on what a reification fallacy is now? Oh my god. It's on purpose. Hold on. Hey, real quick. Branch is incapable of realizing when he's been muted or unmuted. So Branch, here's your official announcement. You're about to be unmuted. Be aware of that. Be cognizant of that fact. Behave accordingly, Branch. <laughs> All my homies hate Branch. All my homies hate Branch. Fuck's sake, Branch. If you don't, <laughs> if you don't hate you don't Branch, hate my homie. Okay, back to the topic. Globe. I'm happy to not be your homie, Snack. No. Okay, so the Globe and the Globe Liars. Home. Um, that say they have science. Now, you may be telling the truth, so we're not going to jump to the conclusion that you're lying about the shape of the Earth, but we can say that you've been miseducated, okay? And given information that doesn't quite match reality. I disagree. Okay, so do you have any science to back up the claim of the heliocentric model? Here we go, here we go, here we go. Yes. I don't know. It's, 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 it's nearly three o'clock. Play it again, it's, Sam. Well, it's yeah. almost three o'clock. Come on. Rinse, rinse, repeat. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm most interested I'm in, bed. Chemo? It's all right. I just want to know, uh, Chemo, why the pilots we'll use the globe to plan their fight yeah. paths. Won't go anywhere. We'll be bringing the facts, the figures, the numbers right here tomorrow. We'll be exposing the globe liars. We'll be looking for the science. We'll be showing how there's a horizontal plane and it never shows any drop. All of those things was. So You've never funny. shown that once, Timo, that there's no drop. In fact, we keep showing you observations that shows there is drop. And then that's related to the elevation that you're at above sea level. And funny enough, every time we do that, you poo-poo and hand wave it away. So you've been shown fuckloads of evidence. That happens that I went down to St. B's, and there's a lighthouse that is meant to be beyond the curvature. 
and not supposed to be seen from a particular elevation height. Now, obviously, we went down there to test it. That's not true. To test it, this is actually true. And what we found is that we were able to see the lighthouse, which shows and proves that the horizon is not physical. We can see a lot further than we're supposed to, which shows that the globe is not something that is in reality. That's what we do. That's, what we, that's how we get down. But again, that's, okay. what, man. that's why we have so much energy and so much confidence, and we're ready to go at any moment. And just about any globe earther can try to tackle these problems. Yes? And we're glad to address any of those problems. Here's a problem. Yes. Here's a problem I want to see you tackle. Why do all pilots train with the knowledge of the globe and use that for all their flight planning? Oh, so that, that is an old wife's tale. Yes, the idea is to keep the plane. Let's level. see who's right. Let's see who's right. I'm going to post something. You tell me if it's right or wrong. Well, again, we've got pilots on record stating that the Earth is flat, that they don't account for any curvature, they don't nose the, nose the plane down. And the experts agree with what we. Okay, so I just posted something from the FAA about training yes. for navigation for pilots. Why does this talk all about the globe then, if all that's wrong? Because that is part of the deception, part of the uh, indoctrination. Now, if you go out there... So then you... why do they get where they're going so well without getting lost? Because they're navigated um, from the control room. You don't just fly by yourself. You know, you just... No, you're not navigated by control room. You mean you register a flight plan. Yeah, you um, back, you're then back, handed off from your there, local control I mean, tower. The only reason why you're in the plane is if the plane is. Till you get to your the... point. I'm in the middle of a sentence, Kimmy. Oh, why are you interrupting me? I was talking, but go ahead. Oh, I'm sorry that I'm in the middle of my sentence interrupted the beginning no, that of yours. I'm so sorry. That's not what happened. Carry on. You're entitled. Continue interrupting him. Carry on. No, you're not prepared to let me get my point out, so I'm going to shut the fuck up, Kimo, because it's pointless. There's no point addressing this point to you, because you'll just hand wave it away, ignore it, or find some excuse <laughs> for another piece of bullshit. Like what you're saying with the FAA, you've got no proof that it's part of a collusion. You're making a claim without evidence, again. Oh, I forgot my point now. Yeah, I'm going to give you some bad, uh, some bad news, Kimo, but the oh. airplanes are not controlled from the control oh, room. The control by like pallets is put in the front of the fucking airplane, Kimo. For a minute, then I thought you were going to say we yeah, got like in the vacuum. My heart just raced, like bubble and bubble and bu you know, because I thought they're going to do it. We have to give up flat Earth. Okay, blah blah blah, blah 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 blah. We live another day. Got it. But go on. What about planes then? Yeah. Once again, Kimo avoided the point, ignored it, and just wanted to get his own little bit of rhetoric out. Now, so what's the point nervous, engaging with Because blue is all about the cabinet. So I thought he was like Kimo. We've got Cavendish in the vacuum. What are you going to do? And I'm like, he also holds a pilot's license, Kimo. I don't need Cavendish in a vacuum, Kimo. You need Cavendish in a vacuum. When are you going to do it? Because you need it in a vacuum to prove that you have a gravitational No, 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 no. No, we don't, Kimo. So you're the one that needs it, it in a vacuum. When are you going to do Cavendish in a vacuum? When are you going to prove that mass does not attract mass in a vacuum? That's your claim. You need to prove it. It's already been done. The paper tells you why it needs to be done in the vacuum. It needs to account for the air and such like. It was done and it showed no, no it movement. It showed no movement because mass does not attract does mass. Not. Just lying about it, Kimo. Well, then you, provide you, the you make the claim that it doesn't work in a vacuum. You're the one that needs to prove that it doesn't work in a vacuum. You don't prove a negative claim. Reach. That's not how it works. To he prove a negative no, claim, you require like, omniscience. That's why the burden of proof is on the positive claim. Percent. I mean, you percent. you don't understand what a positive or negative claim is. Percent. Claim. You making? Percent. Yeah, you you're making that's, that's, the claim. That's not a negative claim, by the way. Yeah, yeah it's not a negative claim. Yeah, you're the making claim the positive is, claim that something is not true. That's a positive claim. That's not a negative claim. Saying yes, it doesn't don't work in a vacuum. Negative claim. Negative claim. Yeah, it's, yes. not, it's not that negative. Yes, look up what a yes, negative claim is. Look up what a negative claim is. Your claim, you made it, you, you own it, you live with it. It's your claim, guys. Yeah, you make uh, a negative claim. That, 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 that was a negative claim. No. <laughs> you no, it was it. clear. You guys are not claiming that it works no, in a vacuum. No, no. Negative claim is that is that when, when you say like something like uh, uh, something doesn't exist like like if if i say like um uh exactly. everything it doesn't work no 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 you don't you don't understand what the negative claim is 
It's not a negative thing. Do you not understand? When I said... It's easier to explain that the the burden of proof is on the person making the claim, whatever the claim is. Yeah, and they're claiming it works in a vacuum. Okay, we're claiming it doesn't matter. It, no, my claim is it, that regard, it, whether or not you think it works in a vacuum, we don't have to demonstrate that it works in a vacuum. They claim that it works claim irrelevant. Okay, we're claiming that it's a, the, the amount of air pressure in the chamber is irrelevant because that's something we can control for. That's my claim. Right? So if the if the air pressure in the chamber does not change whenever we conduct this experiment with different masses, then the then the, the claim that the air, the air pressure in the chamber is what's causing the effect is debunked. Anyways, don't worry about the it. Problem is a months, percentage. One, one second just before you we get in there, this and we'll have a good experiment. Hopefully. Oh wow, why so might not working? It's working. Just people are trying to talk over one another, Drus, and they're not being being very polite or mature about the conversation. What was the point that wants to make to percentage was very quickly is that we're not making the claim that it does or does not work in a vacuum. Chemo has made the claim that it doesn't. So you guys don't contend that Wait, what happened? works everywhere. Yeah. On Chemo's Earth. made the claim percentage. He started this with it doesn't work in it with no evidence. No, no you I'm guys are claiming that claim Cavendish works that it doesn't work in, in a vacuum. And in vacuum. Yeah, he or, are you guys claiming that Cavendish in works in atmosphere? And says that that all your claims? Okay, you carry on percentage and don't let me finish my phone. Carry on. Right. So, so, who, who claimed the thing about the vacuum? That Cavendish works only in atmosphere. Chemo did. Alright, wh what did Chemo claim? Chemo, Chemo basically made the claim that the air movement in around the Cavendish is what's making it move, therefore we need to eliminate this variable, and the only way to do that is to do it in a vacuum. Therefore, Cavendish will only be valid in a vacuum. That was Chemo's claim. Yeah, so are you guys saying words that like Cavendish the only works in the atmosphere? Yes or no? That's interesting, bro. Well, what really claim has he not percentage? No, 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 percentage. No, no, our claim is it doesn't make any difference. Yes. Okay, so it works in both the vacuum and science. atmosphere. We never even made a claim about whether it needs to be in a vacuum or it needs to be in the atmosphere or it needs to be on a Tuesday. Yeah, so you're saying it doesn't make any yeah, difference it it work work out, out. in both a vacuum Prove and so when, when they do Cavendish, they do. Prove it. Show us that it doesn't work in a vacuum. There are no external influences. So Again, blue mark is that it doesn't make any don't, difference, so therefore it just claim. works in both vacuum okay. and atmosphere. Percentage. My, no, no. My percentage. Argument. I'll go halfway to you, okay? Let's meet halfway. Mass attract mass only inside air pressure, okay? Do we and live in so vacuum? Do we live in a vacuum? What do I care about vacuum? All right. It, only it does work that. where there that's, is that's air, and there is air here. Therefore, it works. What else do you want? Do you guys all agree with this guy? No. It only I'm works saying in it atmosphere? doesn't matter. I'm saying that we can control for air pressure. It doesn't have to have zero air pressure or zero air movement, Fair because enough. these are all things exactly. that we can control for. It's been done in a vacuum, but it's never been seen. It doesn't matter because we can control for the amount of air pressure in the chamber. All right, so explain well, then. Sorry. Okay, sorry. fine. Sorry. So my, my contention is then why doesn't it work in a vacuum? But Kimo, to, Nobody to, said it doesn't work in a vacuum. Ah, Why, so it who does says work it doesn't work in a vacuum? So it does vacuum. work in a vacuum. Excellent. So if you're saying... I haven't claimed that it does or doesn't. You're the one claiming that it works. No, I'm, not, I'm saying... I'm saying it, 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 it doesn't work in a vacuum. That's his claim. Nobody else's. You claim Kimo it's been doing in a vacuum. It's not working in a vacuum. It is I'd, I'd, I'd be willing to prove that. Oh, I can't even talk. Phone him mute me. Jeremy, look, that's oh, Jeremy's God as well. Look, all the flight is a God now because we're being phone muted. That's the science, Kimo. No one can hear us. I'd be willing to make the prediction that it'll it'll work in a vacuum, but I don't I don't make a claim. I don't I haven't I haven't directly seen it. I I'm willing I'd say I, with a with a high degree of confidence, I will make the prediction that it absolutely will work in a vacuum. It does. I have a citation. Yeah. yeah. So, it's been done I mean, plenty of so times. Chemo, I'm sure so Chemo, when are you going to do this experiment? What do you mean with a high level of predictability? If it works in a high degree of confidence, do you know how predictions work? work? No, 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 no. You're missing the point here, Snack. So, yes, what? people have said it's been done. And there's papers on it. But observation-wise, has never been seen. Have you ever seen it in a vacuum? 
Apex, no. the observation chemo, stop being stupid. Nobody has ever seen yeah. mass attracted mass in a vacuum. Have you seen the 24 hour <laughs> yes, sun you... in the north? Well, that's not or are you like, just looking at not, videos? That's not an experiment, is it? Uh oh. An observation. Uh -oh. But do we have an experiment of mass attracting mass in a vacuum? Yeah, yeah and you've been shattered by the chemo. So I don't know why you're you pretending. To... Sorry. We actually do. We've got photos of the uh, International <laughs> Space Station. <laughs> he said photos. Do you have the actual mm -hmm. observation of it moving? Yeah. Yeah, we got lots of video of the ISS. It's mass attracting mass in a fucking vacuum, Oh, buddy. my gosh. I'm talking about a practical demonstration. That is a practical demonstration. Oh. It's really easy. You don't have to do anything. Just look at That's it. That's the effect we're seeing. We need to... Pass the uh, the force. <laughs> it's only staying up there because gra because of gravity, chemo. Oh, it hangs chemo. It hangs itself up there because the Earth attracts it. So we all admit that it none of you can Earth. produce mass attracting mass in a vacuum today, at least. No, there's no claim about that made by us. No, I'm saying mass to... attracts mass. We don't stipulate where that mass has to be. No, I know the claim exists today. It to be there's no. That's no Part, no, I know no today you still believe it, it exists. Your claim solely, yours, nobody else's. Okay, I get that today. People believe that, but has there been an, a, a, a demonstration of this, of this idea of mass attracting mass? I don't care. Doesn't matter. So no one's ever seen it. Doesn't matter to me. Uh, are you playing there now, now uh, Kimo? Well, you always say that it works in a vacuum. The only claim I make. The only claim I make. You're claiming that it works in a vacuum, so if we can prove I'll it, it works in a vacuum. I'll stipulate whether it has to be in an atmosphere or in a vacuum or done on a Tuesday or done by a Christian. I don't make any of those claims, none of those at all. I only say mass attracts mass, period. But mass cannot I'll make attract. the claim that it works in a vacuum because it's been proven. Well, go on, then. let's have a look. Then. We've seen Blue do it in the atmosphere. We know the atmosphere uh, causes it, yeah? i down that road. We know Blue's experiment. We Before saw Blue. It, we saw but, Blue's experiment. No, we all watched that. Don't about a vacuum. And blue had pressure, air pressure, in the container, pressing against the you know container. What? Now, I have air pressure the... outside the container, too, Kimo. Oh, that's just, air that's just, the, that's just the temperature. That's just the draft moving around. I live here. Now, if blue did his proven. experiment in a vacuum, Three. there would be no movement because the cause has been manipulated. That's the your cause claim. has been verified. That's your claim, Kimo. Wait a minute. That's my claim. Claim. We get the same results in vacuum. Perfect. What do you mean that's yeah, my claim? I'm saying to you husband. that your cause was the air. You know there's air. Yeah, but blue is shown precisely. When you put the big balls next to the little balls, they move. There is no such thing. So, 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 Kim has demonstrated that he's the only one that thinks that there's a problem because of the air pressure. So now he uh, uh, obviously is now making the claim that does this work or not in a vacuum? He's asking this question. So it's his claim that he's got doubts to, so he needs to provide his burden of proof to show either it works or it does not. Are you going to do this, Kimo? No, the claim is that mass You're attracts... You're not going to do this, okay. Yeah, the claim is that mass attracts mass in a vacuum. It works in a vacuum. There's no, no that's evidence. Not the claim. There's no evidence of this. Not the claim, Kimo. Build on the the claim? Make, Kimo. I'll make that claim. claim sure. mass attracts mass in a vacuum. Yeah, there's papers, mass, there's papers, mass, there's papers there, Bambino. People have written papers about what they think Everywhere. happens inside a vacuum, but they've never shown what happens in the vacuum. Yeah, they don't have to. Oh, they have. Gambino says, blaming. yeah, they have. So show that, Gambino. Let's have a look at this observation. I have to. Gambino. If you want to say it doesn't, you have to show that. Gambino, can you show yeah, you mass attracted mass you, in a vacuum? You can't have it. Not that. Your problem. It's your problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah let me ask you this, though, Kimo. Hold on a second. I'm, uh, can I use the same methods that you use to show that there's a 24 hour sun in the north? All you have to do is show the natural phenomena of no, mass attraction. No, just mass. answer my question. Don't ramble on, just answer my question. Yeah, if you can show cavities in a vacuum, you've got science. Let's have a look. Okay, question, can though? I show you in the same way that you show but us I've told you what you should show. I've told you. Why are you asking me what What can you do? What you need to show is mass attracting mass in Kimo, a vacuum. Can you shut the fuck up, Okay, Kimo. all right. Without any specificity from you, I'm going to use the same methods that you already accept, so I'm just going to link the paper. Okay. Kimo, Kimo, seriously, bro. What's up? All I've heard was talk. I haven't heard this guy even have a second to respond back to you. Mm -hmm. Stop it. 
Look, what we're looking for, si uh, what we're looking for, Branch, is science. Why uh, are you bullying? Now, Gambino has made a wild, outrageous claim Emo, that he has seen the mass that, yeah, mass in the vacuum. May think so let's take a look at that. He doesn't give you the right to bully him. Yes, but we're looking for science, Branch, and you're derailing now because you're talking about... I don't know what you're talking about. Let's stick to the topic. Uh, all, I'm, all I'm asking is for you to be a little bit nicer towards people. Okay, I will try, Branch. Okay, so look... Let's get back to the most important thing, which is gravity, which is supposed to hold the atmosphere down, which is supposed to cause the tides, which is supposed to keep us on the Earth. Now, obviously, without an experiment to back that up, we're pretty much left in the dark as to how these things happen. Cavendish is the experiment that exactly. proves its existence. Exactly. So once we have Cavendish hey. in a vacuum, I mean, the, the cause has been manipulated. Hi, oh, you have it. You've Hi, done it. Kimo. Let's have a look. Hi. Hi. Hi, Hello. Keith. Hi, Kimo. Hi, hello, hello. I would just like to ask, have you ever done any science? Absolutely. Uh, obviously, when we see things fall in nature, you know, well, the cause of the Show me your experiment. Show me your experiment that you've done and what observation, and show me the four steps of the scientific method within your experiment. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, what kind of a scientific experiment would you like to see? Um, no, show me one that you've actually done in the past. Show it. What would you like to see? Which one? We don't know which ones you've done, so how do we know? I don't know what he's looking for. What is he looking for? What does he want? Have you done an experiment? I, got, I just told you. I got an idea. A scientific experiment that you have done where you follow QE's scientific Kima? method. Oh, and obviously... Show it needs us the to cause fully... of seasons on Yeah, Twitter. and it needs, to be fully, it needs to be fully videoed so we can see it live because, you know, anecdotes is just wild claims, according to Kimo, um, and papers aren't valid, so he can't give us the we've written down method and experiment. He needs to show us in video because that's his standard. That's not well, that's that's standard. Question answer. That's oh, false. Well, Again, well, address well, with well, false well, information. Well, that's not what was that's stipulated. That's actually a standard? Because Gambino, I didn't ask you to show that blue, Cavendish. Was that on a Monday? I'm asking you to show yeah. anybody who was shown Cavendish in a vacuum Virgin. at any time. Yeah, at the University of Washington. Is there anybody Kimo, out there Kimo, other than Kimo, yourself Kimo, who was doing Kimo. this? There's a difference. Kimo, I'm answering you and you're pretending not to I'll hear me. second branch. Oh, you're... No, he does that. Gambino. You guys, you guys, let Kimo answer my question. Show us the scientific experiment that you yourself have done that follows QE's scientific method. Go. What is the claim? What is the observed phenomenon? No. Can you show us what causes seasons on flat Earth? No. No, I don't care about that. I want okay. a scientific so model. experiment. Kimo can, you, can you show us why objects fall to the ground? Of course. Uh, okay, let's see the science that follows your method that proves that. Yeah, so the acceleration, especially. So obviously, when you pick an object up, I can give you the gravity. Well, I can give it to you. You've uh, you caused this effect. Problem. Well, wait. We need the video. Of what? I just want to. An apple I want to of the your ground. experiment. Scientific experiment Kimo has done, where he's followed QE scientific method to the T. I want to see a video of that. Go, he says Kimo. he's trying to right now, but he's failing. Well, I get it. Depends on. Uh, but you asked about gravity. Yep. So no. Any oh, scientific experiment. Yeah. We don't know what experiments you conducted in your secret cabal of cultish followers. Um, so you need to inform us what experiment have you done that meets QE standard that you have a full end-to-end -end unedited video for. Uh, yeah, we've validated uh, why things fall. No, not you. No, uh, you, we're not you. we, you. I've, d I've done the same. Yeah, absolutely. I want to see it. Show us. Um, yeah, it's going to be a uh, look on the channel somewhere. You'll find it. No, show. link it to us. Show us. It's going to take me a while to show it. You've just asked for it just now. I didn't know you wanted that. What do you, you mean? You've never given any time to do that. Have you have <laughs> not got it, have you? <laughs> what, what's, what's the experiment, experiment about, about until he presents it? Oh, I don't have my one, but I do have, that, I, do have uh, I do have other people. Wait, wait you don't have, had, wait, wait, you don't wait, have wait, an experiment? Wait, guys. Wait, guys. Wait, guys. Wait, he's had two years. He's I've had been asking Timo this for at least a year, and he hasn't shown me anything. So even in the last year, he could have had time to have done it. 
Yeah, I mean, we've shown you uh, all kinds of experiments, uh, Chris, as to why things fall uh, relative density to equilibrium. It's not a difficult experiment. What, what experiment do we have to do to prove the ball to you, Kimo? What would you do to falsify the flat Earth? Falsify the flat Earth? You'd have to show that the Earth is curving. What would you do mm -hmm. if you had unlimited money and resources? What would you produce for the public to falsify the flat Earth? You don't need unlimited. You need the radius of the Earth, and uh, you just need to show that the Earth is either curving or not. So would you put sticks in the ground with a rope and just a 25,000-mile rope, 30,000, 40,000-mile rope, and just, like you said, you have to map the Earth? Or, like, how would you do it, Kimo? How would I do what? Measure your Lord. circumference of your flat earth. I mean, if you, you can ignore the question, Kimo. It's all good. I mean, Kimo, uh, describe an experiment which can falsify the flat earth. Um, experiment wise, <laughs> there aren't any experiments, but there are measurements you can do. Okay, describe a measurement which you, which you can do. Be specific. Which you can the flat earth. accent. Yes, yeah, so, I mean, you can uh, establish uh, your horizontal plane and uh, you can still. And figure out if um, the Earth, if there was any drop, elevation drop, over water, <coughs> over water. Well, people done it, and there is a drop. So that's what they say. That's what they say. People say oh, it's been done, but it's... there's no evidence yeah. or hey. proof that it's been done. Hey, hey, hey Kimo. Do you have a, you... a fully documented and videoed experiment where you're making this observation so you can show us that you got that null result, or is this just a wild claim you're making? Uh, these are scientific experiments that uh, the community has conducted. And, no, 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 not the community, you, Kimo. I don't care about the community, I care about you. It's not about me. We're not talking about but community, if, if we're talking you want, about you. If you, want to, uh, if you want us to accept experiments done by your community, um, then you have to accept the experiments done by our community, which involves most of the scientists, unfortunately for you. I'm not asking you to accept what we do. We're, what we're doing is looking for the science of a globe. We don't have a model. We don't have a map. Hey, hey Kimo. We're not I saying for you to you accept anything it. unless you research it for yourself and have a measurement. Hey, Kimo. I got an experiment for you. Okay. Falsify the constant of gravity by trying to measure a different constant. What is gravity? And there we have it. Want to answer that one? There we go. You see. For me, I, I label it very, very simply. Gravity is an observation of acceleration towards Oh means. my god. There we go. Nice, nice and simple. We Dude, can do it just wait, like that. Wait. We don't have to invoke anything else. That's where the observation started. Things fall. We labeled it gravity. It's a good, it's a good question. What is what gravity? What does fall? What falls? How, how about we get back to the question I asked? By chemo, will you falsify the constant of gravity at 9.8 meters per second squared? Try and falsify it. Gravity, if what is this gravity? That, How can I falsify something? Well, I don't even know what it is. Gravity. What no, I'm is talking it? about the acceleration downward, which Newton called gravity. Okay, so what is it exactly? It's the acceleration the towards the ground at 9.8 meters per second squared. Where, where do you see that then? Where's Things that? Things don't fall at a constant nowhere. Chris. Whenever you drop something, you see it. Whenever something drops from the sky, you see. They fall at different you rates, can though, that Chris. Acceleration. Now, if, if Chemo can so measure does an apple, does an apple if drop? Can, does an if apple he can drop do, if that a different constant besides 9.8 meters per second squared, then he has falsified gravity, or what we call the acceleration downward, gravity. How did you get that number, Chris? Multiple people have measured it. That's how I got the number. Fine, fine. Other people. Can you show me the person who measured it? Our community did it. Everyone did that's it. ever measured it, you can go research that. Who? I don't need who? To who has you. measured it, Chris? Uh, Newton. Uh, anyone Newton? else? Any other scientist that has measured it? I don't know. I didn't. Look you don't know. So you don't know who got made this number up. Measured nine point meters. Just gonna throw out a number of nine point meters. 9.8 meters per second. Dr. Amor so, um, um, measured at chemo. He was my physics teacher in, in high school. Do you know him, Great. Chris? I've never been to China either. You know that Should physics teacher, Chris? 
You know, why should the... he know it? That that's someone I know that's measured it. So why are you Chris asking for why people that have measured it? I asked Chris, not you. Mm. Mm. I know a, a person named Newton who measured it. Okay, let's have a look at his work. I let's don't see, know let's, him personally because I, of course, I did nine point meet, live meet back second. during Newton's time. How do you know that, Chris? Because it's documented, Kimo. Who documented it, Chris? His name is Newton. Have you heard of him? So Newton documented it. Yeah, how do we know Newton documented it? Because we have his documentation. How do you know it's his? How do you know it wasn't just made last week? Or last year? Or ten years ago? Before you how were born? How do you know any book? These are all, these are all hey, good hey, questions Kimo? to ask Flat Earthers the next time they bring anything up. Hey, Kimo, I got a question for you. Any book ever printed, how do you know the author wrote the book? I don't. Could have been a why, you, why do you read any book for that matter? He doesn't. What makes you think Kimo reads Wait, a fucking Eric book? Dubé when do you think the last it? time he cracked open a book was? The Bible. Eric, Eric Dubé wrote a the book. The Bible. I think it was Eric Dubé. <laughs> I was about 1978, I think. The earth is flat. Why would you answer <laughs> when with a question of what you read? Unless you have a reading comprehension problem. <laughs> I'm just curious. Eric Dubé wrote a book called A Hundred Proofs the Earth is Flat. How do we know he actually wrote that book? We don't. Perfect. So how can we trust a book we don't know that he actually wrote? We can't. He didn't write A Hundred Proofs. Whoever wrote that book, I don't care. How do we know that person wrote that book? And if we don't know, how can we trust the book? We can't. We don't. There we go. The Earth isn't flat. There you go. <laughs> so that's how we do things around here. We uh, get to the points quickly. We uh, expose how, how the liars ferociously in a very book, fast the book way. Hero. We don't. So therefore, he didn't write it, and therefore the earth isn't flat. We just don't know those things, though, do we? What do we know about where we live, Chris? Well, I know that I, I work at Walmart. I know that for a fact. Uh -huh, and and that I don't proves, have to tape record that it for you. the shape of Walmart. Okay, fine. What about the earth? Don't know. Nobody knows, Chris. That's the whole I, point. I, we're I all wondering. We're all, we're all guessing the state, what the shape of the earth the looks like, I, where we live, why we're here. Mm hmm. I do know the state. That... Mm hmm. The state that you're in? You're in a very bad state right now, Chris. Yes. Whatever state I live in, which I'm not giving it that information out, in a but very some bad people state, do Chris. know. Some people do know. An awful state. Looks Chris. relatively level. Well, because like I, I say, um, poetry is interesting. We should reserve it for the theatre. Um, but what we're looking for is actual measurements and actual science. And uh, unless we have either of those things, Perfect. we are we are simply I know for preaching. Because the I'm... car that I ride in to go to work. Do they prove the shape measure, of the road? Do they prove the shape of work? Of how far that is, and it's about three and a half miles to my work. Improve the shape of work, yeah. So I know what I've done for you, Lyle. At least I know the Earth is at least three miles long because it's three and a half miles to my work. Okay, so you know the shape of work. No, no, I know the shape. I know the distance across the Earth has to be greater than three and a half miles because it's three and a half miles to my work. But what about the shape of Earth? What is the shape of the Earth? It's a sphere. How do you know? All the pictures from space. Pictures from space. The picture from the moon. Pictures from the moon. What medium is space? What medium is the moon in? Kimo, don't go to the pictures. You have been going today to the pictures. What is the don't medium? Don't go there. Chris, I'm here, mate. These pictures... mate. Mate, 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 Don't talk about the pictures. What? You don't know how to identify a falsified picture to a real picture. Uh, uh, don't go there. Wait, are you asking me how? Yeah. No, Kimo, I'm asking Kimo, about the medium Kimo. the moon is in, Chris. Never go deep, Kimo. You're, you're what is the medium? Huh? Never go deep. I'm kind of confused. Is Kimo asking me how do I know what space is? Yeah, what is space? What is that medium? It's less air molecules than we have on Earth. So space less is air. Of gas. Is space air? Well, wait, let me correct what I said. Okay. It is less molecules, molecules of gas spread out more. Uh -huh. Um in a bigger area than the area of the Earth. Yeah. So space is air, basically. No, I no. said mole gas molecules. 
Yeah, yeah, gas, gas, what we breathe, yeah? Yeah, it yeah, has so more there's, area there's gas in air in space, the space is just air, but just less of it. No, no. No, no it's an, no, it's a a volume volume of space of area then. where gas molecules exist in that is less, are, are, mm -hmm. has more space to move in than the Earth. Yeah. Be because that area, volume, is greater than the volume of the Earth. Okay. So what is the medium of space? Air. We're going to go with gas and air, no. yeah? No. No? Look up the definition of air. What is the definition? Sorry. What is the uh, medium? Emo! Why are you dominating chat so? Uh, we're just asking questions about space. Air is Jesus. the invisible gaseous is substance we? surrounding the Earth. Who's this we? You do you, I'll do I. So, the volume of does anyone the have volume? Um, an idea of what air space? is the invisible gaseous substance surrounding the earth, which is mainly a mixture of oxygen and nitrogen? Mm -hmm. So, space is not air because air is something specific. Okay, what is the medium of space? What is it? Let, let me say this one more time, Chemo. The volume of space around the earth that extends for a very long distance is filled with molecules. And those uh -huh. molecules have more gas molecules, and those molecules have more room to move around then than they do here on Earth. I know. That's what you said already. So I'm saying space that is, what, I call is space. what you've just described. Molecules moving around, gas moving around, filling the space. Yeah? Question. Really Who get their the information space. from Chris Lale? Anyone? But Chris, you got the gases you know, filling Does anyone get their information I, from Leo? Anyone? My Not hard, Chris. Simple. You said it right. There are molecules in space that are moving around. So there's gas in space moving around, filling space, expanding, move, do all these things, yeah? In space. No, no, there, there's a volume of space around the Earth that is a lot greater than the Earth that gas molecules can expand and go into mm -hmm. that. It, is, is a lot larger in, in area than the Earth. Mm -hmm. So what is the medium then of space? Is it the stuff you just described? The me I don't know what you mean by medium. So the medium that we're in now is air. You can go into water, a different medium. Yes, you can go into lava, a different medium. So what is space? What is that medium? Yet another different medium. <laughs> is it air? All, all the air molecules in a greater volume. So space is air, then just gas. No, no, I didn't say that. I so said what is the medium then in space? Gas molecules in a greater volume. Like we can have um, lava in the air, we can have water in the air, we can have air under the water, which will escape. So what is space? What medium is that? No, what what is the air in, Kimo? Space is the dimensions of height, depth, and width, which within which all things exist. Mm-hmm. What is the air in? The lava's in the air, but what's the air in, Chemo? The air is in the water, and it in escapes and go up, goes up. Hey, Snack, how many times do you let your kids repeat themselves before you slap them? I beat my kids regularly so they don't ever get those kind of ideas in their heads to start repeating themselves. Hey, hey, Chemo, I got a more valid question for you. Sure. How much volume of air do you have in your head? Uh, I, had some kids, say I, that I would I'm say a, about three. They, they say could repeat themselves a, three times. I'm an airhead, yeah. Not much in there. But again, there's only one way to find out, Chris, and that is to provide... Uh, Cut it open and look at it. Yeah, so if you can provide those experiments, um, obviously those claims of me being an airhead, no air, no brain, whatever you want to say, will be validated. But obviously until that day, um, we're obviously in the lead when it comes to knowledge and science and uh, facts, figures. Figuring things out, so you have none. You have no facts. You have no figures. Yeah, I mean, damn, so, yeah. Kimo, what's wrong with you? Well, I mean, I guess all we do is looking for. Why would uh, you pose for that picture? That background is all terrible. Well, oh look, God. we have the same views. Okay. Yes, you do. We do. We see the same. We see the same. We have the same perspective on life. Yeah, you're a disgusting, hey, despicable hey, human, human being. What do you mean? Hey, Kimo, I want to apologize to flat earthers, We have the same views hey, in life. Hey, VD, I need to apologize to you for giving a very first grade answer to what space is. Sorry about that. But I had to give it in a way Kimo could at least try to understand. I don't think anybody knows what's the medium of space. 
Um, that's how we know base is not right. real because we've never been able to go there and test what it. Is. Yeah, I think most people don't consider it much of a medium except for the uh, air particles that are far apart from each other. Okay, it is a medium in the sense that energy can travel through it. That's what determines whether or not something's a medium. Exactly. So, what is the medium of space? Exactly. It's space. Space is medium. What is that medium? It's space. Oh my god. I don't know what you want me to say. Space. No, technically, it is... technically, it's not a medium. It's a... No, a vacuum is actually considered a medium. Space is considered a medium. Oh my gosh. None of you know anything about where we live. That's the problem. Yeah. You guess. How about this? A volume of like area where gas molecules can travel is what we call space. Honest. Yeah. Mode, getting it's y'all unraveled. A, a vacuum is more of a lack of medium than anything. What we do, oh, Don? Oh, it's a medium. It's not a medium. Yeah. We're getting we're, fucking we're crazy. Ultra, ultra direct. That's it. We're That's uber it. Direct. And uh, <laughs> we, we've got a job to do. Uh, expose the heliocentric lie. And uh, <laughs> remember, there, there is only some of us who are able to navigate through, you know, like, the mass. Bit, and uh, expose lie essentially Kim, you, you've been exposing the lie for i don't know six years seven years no one in, no in one physics, no one except no one except of you buying that so in oh, physics a medium sense. is defined as a substance that transfers the energy or light from one substance to another substance or from one place to another uh or from one surface to another the medium acts as a carrier the medium can transfer any form I don't know. Is space medium? I'm kind of because it's it's not yes. actually transferring you energy. Just said yes. I, mean, I know energy. I, I I initially thought yes, space is a medium, but then now I'm thinking it's not. It's it's not technically a substance, no, and it's, it's not really words. transferring it is technically energy. A substance. We just it, don't know what it is, is just, yet. Hang on, energy is just passing through. It's not really being transmitted no. by it, space. It, there's a it's it's, a, it's uh, the electromagnetic field is in space. It is space? That's I guess the same thing maybe. And that's it, what is propagating, or that's what propagates. And I think that, I think that makes it a medium. The fact no, that, it's the, the, that those are those are fields, but um, a vacuum is as much a quantity as zero. I mean, as much a, a medium as zero is a quantity, because uh, it's no, it's but really, but, uh, but space yeah. isn't really a vacuum. We we know that it's not truly a vacuum. Yeah, it's stuff in. The space yeah, you're right. Space That's why you can describe it as a, a near vacuum. Air, vacuum gas, or air right, constitutes the... a good transmission medium for electromagnetic waves. I guess it would be considered a Don't medium according to... Definitions. Go on then, Don. Over to you, Don. Get them, Don. Well, y'all should make a characteristic list and see where the agreements and disagreements are separate. We're, not even, we're doing right now. We just did it. It's a medium for the EM.